recording. Done and done there. Let's see what else we got going on here. Um, make sure that's everything. Oh, snippet. I always forget this damn snippet. Let's see. Where is it? Snippet. Okay, minimize that. <sighs> always forget something. What you doing there, pooper? Oh, you got your toy. Just for me. Go get it. <laughs> oh, you'll bring it back. Oh, no, you'll bring it back. Okay, fine. Go get it. <laughs> My goodness. What? One more? Okay, fine. Go get it. Oh. Oh my God. Big meanie, you big meanie, you give me the toy. You drop it. Drop it. You see it. Go get it. <laughs> okay, no more, baby. No more. No more. You want to play more? Ask your sister. Here we go. <laughs> oh. mm. Never seems to fail. Team speak, please. Reset. Bing. Oh, Jesus. Don't start nothing with the local. Okay. But you messed my mic up here. Bent all funny. <laughs> Okay. Oh, it's warm. This stuff off. Steps. Pink. And close. Coat. Pink. Then sleeves. Pink. Right, let's see if that's everything. I think so. Everything look good? Yes. All right. Good to go, but uh, I I'd like it if you just uh, kind of left town for a little while. How we doing, bud?
if I get sucked in and clocking in early, or if I can actually go care what I need to take care of. Oh, I'm going to be stuck here for a minute. Yeah, I tried to one up because I don't have a gun. <laughs> I don't have a gun. Mr. Tickles shot one. And then and I had to walk out of one because he was trapping me with his gun. Fucking local. Get over to Strawberry before I get sucked into some bullshit. Looking for, for new faces around around the Navy. The U.S. Navy, huh? What would it be? Well, we patrol the rivers. We, we 
we uh, we patrol down near Mexico. Uh, how do you do? Oh, life at sea, lads. Hey, that doesn't sound too bad. Yeah, it's and we also uh, we also patrol around Guarma. Full of seamen, apparently. Full of seamen, eh? Yeah, well, yeah. And salt. It's a it's a salty job. That is down in the ocean. Yeah. I'm allergic it, to it salt. It can be actually. I can't yeah, have so any of it at all. I guess we can't see <laughs> you in Guarma. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's far away, that. Aye, we, uh, we're the uh, active law enforcement over there. Oh, the navies. I thought you fellas were down in Rhodes, no? Oh, uh, we're all over. Oh, down on, on the San Luis River, Flatiron Lake, and in Guarma. What, you just patrol around there? Aye. What the fuck are you looking for, boys? Like, there's no <laughs> <laughs> sharks, like, fucking... A uh, couple of fucking crazy fucking turtles in the waters, I hear, you know? I got chased by a by a snake the other day. Yeah, All right. Turtles. Oh, snap the turtles! Is it, is it will bite snake? your toes right off. <laughs> nice to have. Right. Well, um, <laughs> I don't think it's for us, boys. But uh, it's nice to see Ad recruiting, I guess, eh? All right. That's all right. Thank you. You thank do you. stay safe now. I'm not too sure about that. You don't know. You don't like the navy there, I mean. It pays what quite well. What kind of is that? Well, it's similar to any lawman job.
stupid people around right now killing folks. I hate it. They were so yeah. annoying content oh my to me. Gosh. Yeah, I had nothing so to do with them. Annoying. In fact, I went to my boys and I said, are you guys associating with the Italians? And two of them were, <laughs> and I fired them on the spot. Yeah, because right? like, you can't, you can't that's, do that. That's, that's the only thing that was true uh, for a lot of people in their eyes, that the Blue Model Ranch had some ties with the Italians. Well, it ended up being true, but... Um, that's why a lot of people were pissed because those Italians they came up in rows, fucking five by with a Molotov on the sheriff boards, shooting oh, everybody, shit. and then going away and just say this is for uh, our family and or well whatever oh they uh, call themselves, and then they all went gone. And normally one of two of them died, but they were always like four or five, and then three always escaped, and then <laughs> like fucking. Five civilians and three fucking sheriffs are down and <laughs> just I got, I got on blamed for all this shit. And all yeah. I was doing was trying to run my ranch, right? Oh yeah. As I was saying to the deputy, I said, "You know me. I haven't done freaking a bad thing at all. Like I haven't done anything. <laughs> you know, it's just oh, even it was awful. even to up the fact that uh, Mexico, like the people of Mexico, nearly came down to like literally investigate because the uh, Italians were going to Mexico as well." Uh, oh shit. And they were going over there and they captured one Mexican and he said that he had ties with the Blue Mother Ranch and he was Oh going my god, <laughs> why? And he, he <laughs> said he was the one that was um, um, just getting uh, instructions from that ranch as, as kind of operation center. <laughs> and, and oh my god. To the, to the nearly fact that the whole fucking army wanted to fucking invade the Commonwealth and go straight to your ranch. Oh like, my god. <laughs> and then I informed them of all the fucking fucking bullshit that's happening lately uh, because that's that Steve that started all that yeah well he he is he was half responsible i guess because there were more people that were fucking around because there were there was also a whole new group that got motivated by that newspaper uh, yeah, but that, as if that was us that wasn't us putting that shit in the newspaper <laughs> no but i oh mean the, the newspaper that uh, y'all shot like eight people for no reason because they were fixing people yeah, got like motivated like like single wolves got motivated and find each other i had a group of four oh people fucking, fucking around on Kamasa range and they were like they didn't know steve they didn't know <laughs> one they didn't know blue mother range but they were keep saying every time when they robbed us or whatever don't fuck with Mad one and then they were giggling and just running off oh God. and then they were captured and they uh, there was a picture made they were four people that were wearing orange jackets fucking deckheads wow. and roads um yeah and the Italians nearly let you run over by a fucking whole mexican army so yeah man oh <laughs> yeah, it's, a good for you. it's a new year <laughs> it's good for me it's a new year yeah starting fresh oh oh the italians didn't last all that long though did they no, but they, they made a big shit show, like, shit literally, show literally, there. literally, there was Caesar from the Mexican army, he was literally done, he had it, he literally wanted, he, he didn't care that there would come on war for just running down to uh, Blue Mother Ranch and then just yeah. do whatever he wants to do there. He didn't care, he said already, well, put the cannons uh, there, uh, if we go over the bridge, we probably already need them. 
<laughs> why though? Why why were they targeting me? Well, because of the Italians that were just still robbing people there, or grave robbing, uh, doing fucking drugs runs, whatever they were doing there. And until one got captured, and he said he works from um, Blue Murder Ranch, and he has ties with them, and he got that he got. Uh, that's where it all started. Well, that's that's not. I think that's halfway in all the shit show. That's yeah. even the shit show you didn't even see, but that was nearly to happen. Well, I had just met Ron, and it was a couple days later. Steve came over with um his girlfriend there. I forget who used to be my doctor. Uh, and, yeah, and, uh, yeah. And he said she she started saying to me like, "You need to not associate with Ron because if you knew who he was, and I didn't know really who he was, right? Uh, mm -hmm. But she's like, if you knew who he was." Okay.
producer. Where the fuck are all these deputies at? I got all these horses. Nobody's here. You okay, dog? Nick on the roof of the bank here. Uh, I, I can hear it. Oh, It'll I be just right. had a head bob. Oh, okay. See you after the storm. I think somebody is stepping on doors.
Head pop. Mm, rage, really? I haven't seen that one in a minute. Uh, did you let Gabby know that Jordan is calling her? Hi from work, by the way. Sorry, I missed all this. Let's see. Okay. Mm. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna just wait on the restart of the server to try to get back on.
waiting for the server to come back up. Oh, nice. Where the hell am I? Back to the bank. Great.
Nice. to me. I understand for those that are new and ill-experienced, but well, it's part of the process. If you don't want to go through the tunnel, every tunnel is different. Every department is different. <laughs> Just walk by and lock the door. I'm fatigued.
downstairs, bud. It's in that door, bud. Hold your old muscle down. How we doing? Um, I'll say I, I haven't played this server in a while, so I'm not really familiar. Dog Alton, what would it be? Yeah, it's not working. Oh, sorry, my bad, sorry. That's a local. Yeah, don't worry about it. I'll take care of these guys over there. Mm. You hold your left alt down and then you look and hit enter on the door. It's not working for some reason. Mm. Might have to take a nap, unfortunately. Yeah, I can see it. yeah, I can see the option, yeah. There we go. Uh, you forgot about another muscle, but we got it squared away. <laughs> Not a problem. Let's see who. Check the paper. Who's on? Okay. First break. Hello. <laughs> Shit, let me get the way. <laughs> You're all good. Where is everyone? No idea, sir. Just uh Probably stretching. Get out of bed now. Nah, I got you. I was going to let them know I'll come and clock in after I go to Strawberry about a horse. <laughs> Distant Deputy Jake Elwood. There goes Doc. <laughs> Sorry, Doc. Oh, that's going to head pop on me. 
Acting funny. Needed here first. You're bouncing by your horse. Oh, is it broke? Oh, so are you. Yep. Shit. Am I? Yeah, fuck. <laughs> ah, crap. Shit. <laughs> hey, miss, if you're on a horse, we can't see it. Yeah, apparently horses are having an issue. Okay, hope and pray. Any better? Much better. There you go. There we go. All right, you jump up and get yours out, mate. I'll let you know. Uh, your horse is invisible. Ah, oh, crap. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, it's invisible. I'll try the the road trick. Now we can see it. Good to go. Uh, nope, you're not. <laughs> I'm still not. The wagon is though. The wagon's fine. Yeah, I see the wagon. Yeah, you're hmm. um, you're still like a wizard. Oh, oh, oh! I need off. <laughs> <laughs> you might need to take a nap, mate. But the problem with that is yeah, yeah, the, yeah, the queue. Train. Yeah. Yep. Well, and all I'm trying to do is go to Strawberry and see what they got for horses before I come back oh, and clock I in. Probably just, just, fuck it, just go for it. <laughs> if anyone says it, say, oh, they're no fellas, sorry. I'll get that fixed as soon as I can, fella. Yep. Yeah, man, good luck. They recognize me at all, that's
Am I invisible? Ah, I've tried it. I tried it five times. <laughs> See if it's different if I do it that way. I'm gonna have to take a nap. Shitty. Always happens. Something doesn't work right. Might as well clear the brokers too. Let's see what else we do here. I mean, how bad are they? Oh, zero. Oh, that's very odd. Never had that happen. That definitely shows it wasn't working right. None of them popped up. All right. Let's get it. First off, you got up and refresh. Here goes nothing. How bad is the line going to be? Mm -hmm. Probably pretty bad. Morning music. We got back.
Let's see if I get lucky. You see my horse, sir? <laughs> He's trying to talk, I can hear him. That's not a good sign either. The locals. No Serena, though. Hmm. What the fuck? Hello. Have you ever heard hey. the bells go off like that? He's never. That's why I went to look, but I didn't see anybody in there. Okay, I just heard it. That was very confusing as hell. Yeah, I don't know how they did that. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, get back here. Damn horse. Oh, sorry, by the way, I don't see your horse at all. Oh, at all? Oh, great. Well, I'll try again.
I don't know what else to do, man. I've been trying with this fucking horse for 15... Two restarts. He doesn't know better because he doesn't know anyone or remember anything. That's what, yeah, so I, I kind of need your help with this one because I'm the only fucking person awake. Yep, let's go. Hello. Jump on. Yeah, Ripley, have you got a horse? Jump on your horse, fella. Come uh, on, me. Come down to the stable. I think yeah, that's where I'll he is. There. Can you see my horse, sir? I can see it. You're good. Okay, good. What's going on? Yeah. Oh, oh, we would have just been here. Oh, no, no, seconds no, ago, yeah. We just came through the back door and nobody, nobody came out. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. fuck. What's going on? He's a, um, he's a corporal from Valentine. <laughs> and he doesn't know his memory is bad and he's going to go do something naughty. Oh, shit. Is that him right there? Oh, no, it's not him. <laughs> come on, you're coming home. Come on, come on, come on. That's the wrong way. Do you need me to clock in? You can't. I can't. You can't. Are you are you one of my deputies? Yes, sir. Oh. Assistant Deputy Elwood. I haven't yet. Luke. Do you need me to? Yes. No, no, no. Just keep, keep, stay with me. Just. Luca. That's Corporal. That's Corporal Adam Luca. Luca, he's out of the hospital. Well, apparently, <laughs> and he's gonna go find Emily's killer on his own whilst he's injured. Oh Jesus. lord, yeah. that's not good. It's not good. <laughs> I can't hog tie him because I might injure him more, right? I injure him more, yeah. <laughs> I can fucking Luca. feel the injuries. This brain injury. Oh. Luca, stop, man. Oh, fuck. That's Luca, right. Don't do that. come on, Luca. fella. Come on, boy. Don't make me laugh <laughs> If it ain't one thing, it's another. Whoa, 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 whoa. Look. Stop. Monroe, I cannot come back on duty right now. You're not, yeah, going, but you're you not going back on go, duty, but... You're not going back on duty, but you can't go out looking for him on your own. I'm not. You told me you were. Never happened. You told me you're gonna go look for him on your own and you're gonna go take the law into your hand. You Luca. can't, Luca. Never you, happened. You're not, you're not, just you're not thinking Emily, straight. Just you're not thinking straight. You're not thinking straight. We will, but Luca, you're not thinking straight. Look. I, I don't know. What do we do? What do we Maybe. do? We're. Oh. Why doesn't he? Why doesn't he just wait around to see Emily? I don't know. 
Wait, which one? Are, which one of? Which one are you? Sorry, I can't. I don't recognise. Is that Johnny? Elwood. Elwood. Sorry, Jake. I don't recognise you with that uniform. What do we do here, man? I'm asking you. <laughs> I personally would hog time and leave him up somewhere, but he might not be too happy I, about that. This is why. <laughs> this is why I wanted the doctor to tell me um, to do that under I a medical. You, I told you to do it. Oh fuck. You want me to go track him down or no? Do I telegram? Oh, fuck, man. If I... Oh, fuck. All right, um, can you... Can you ride, ride us back so I can do some... Mm -hmm. I need to figure out what the fuck. Right now he's danger to himself. I've been trying for three days just to get to Strawberry about a horse, but every time I wake up from a nap, something's going on. <laughs> I need to go to Blackwater because my other doctor. Oh, never mind, they're going. Slow it down there, horsey. <laughs> You're jumping by your horse. Mm, what do I gotta do? Or put it away and bring it back out. Well, shit. So do you need me to clock in, or? Yeah, mate, I might need you. Please. Alrighty. No worries. Oh, boy. We might go on a, a, a Luca hunt. Oh. Excuse me. Be out your way in a hot second here. You ain't in my way, friend. You're good. He's, I, I don't know, something to do with it. He got shot. He's lost all his memory now. He's going to go out here. Um, problem is putting out a bolo for one of your own. Can you mention that it isn't? He didn't is do anything. Right? Yeah, he's mental. Did I say mental? Me medical? Medical. Medical. Yeah. Well, concern. Um, medical concern. Uh, all law and duty as well. Yeah. Hold on. Did he? What did it, it? When you looked at him, there was something specifically that we remembered about him. Do you know what I mean? What was it? Can you remember? What do you mean? Was, was it smells of something or bandage? I can't um, remember. What, what was his 
He looks tired. Is that what it was? Mm -hmm. Okay. Fatigued. Gracious, what a day! I just, <laughs> yeah, been that way the last few days though. I've been trying for three days, three days. To... We're all wearing the same thing. Yes, sir. If you look in the paper there, or um, hold on a second. How we doing, fellers? Uh, friend, how can I help you? I was just looking for the gunsmith. Y'all drive them fellers out of town? No, he should be on after a while. Just everybody's waking up. Alrighty. I'll hang out for a little bit now. Although I heard that gunsmith got in a heap of trouble. Yep. All right, if you go under NHSO documents and scroll up to New Hanover Sheriff's S Sheriff's Office SOP, down in there it'll give you the uh, outfit for the deputies. I thought I had it open. I guess not. I don't know. Open this fucking thing. Yeah, you scroll down to page eight in that SOP and it gives you the uh, uniform. Yeah. Uh, what you want to look for in particular? Well, you're asking about uniforms and what we wear here. Oh, I said, why do them boys in the blue shirt look all the same? That, that... Uh, oh, those are Blue Mountain boys. They always. Oh. They have their own uniform. I said, I said... <laughs> I said, what, did you two ugly son of bitches born from the same mother or what? Like <laughs> yeah, probably not too much. They're kind of a testy folk. Well. Those are a honey, not vinegar type of people. If you catch my drift. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm full of vinegar. <laughs> Aren't we all? Monroe, you must be whipping up something mean in there.
pop it back here a moment. Yep, yep. Sure, you're on the side of your horse. There we go, this will make some folks feel a lot better. <laughs> What's your name? Jake. You got your book hanging off your horse. Yes, sir. You hear me? How about now? You hear me? Can you hear me? You hear me, Doc? But he's in their own head, right? Rush this. Go oh, rush. Oh, no. <laughs> Try now. I could hear him. He couldn't hear me. I don't know. All right. How about now? Can you hear me now? There we go. Yeah. yeah. All right. That was to make folks feel a lot better. Uh, I don't know. It's more the higher ups and. People around town. Yeah. I just got told what to wear when I'm on duty. So I just try to listen. <laughs> well, good on you for being a good one. So, I don't like these shoes. They got laces on them. Why are you wearing them then? Uh, some yeah. Shit kickers. Yeah. Shit, this ain't no city. No, for sure. I just haven't been able to do much of anything <laughs> i wake up from a nap and some shit's going on in town last three days <laughs> my horse is almost 22. that's not a pretty good new one huh yeah i've been trying to get the strawberry Go talk to Katie or Storm, but haven't had a chance to get over there. Oh, I'm dealing with an absolute fucking shitstorm. Jake, apologies, mate. I know you're still an assistant deputy, but can you help out Ripley here just while I sort the shit out? No worries. 
Smells what? In case something goes down, I guess. Get out the porch here. It's making us stressed out. I'll go to the other one. You're getting stressed on the porch? Mm -hmm. I don't. I in in the town or in the office for sure, but not yeah. on the porch. Well, let me tell you something, my friend. Uh, I assure you that sooner or later that porch is going to stress you out worse than inside. <laughs> they said there was an issue about it there for a while, but. I got a little stress from clocking in, but nothing crazy. What's your stress at right now? Oh, I'm good. That force doesn't fuck with me right now, but just heed my advice. It will. Hey, you. What's your name? Jake. Elwood. Elwood? Yes, sir. We have a lot of J's in here, so I just go by Elwood. I got you. I'm Drake. Drake Ripley. That's close to a J, too. <laughs> That's pretty close, yeah. Sounds J-ish. We have J, Jim, James, Johnny, me, Jake. Yeah, there are a lot of J's. But it's all good. Uh, here in a minute, we'll go wander about town, make sure everybody's doing all right. But I figured shit ain't going to pop up for another... 10, 15, wait for everybody to wake up. Hopefully. Give LT a chance to get this shit figured out. Yeah, whatever he's trying to figure out. Good lord. How's about we go on a little walk and check out town? Yep, yep. Uh, this way. Stick behind the buildings and then down Main Street and behind the other ones. There was a snake on the bank before the storm. I had to get rid of. How you doing? Who you say that to? Oh, shit, yeah. that lady. Good lord. Yeah, she's bouncing around, she, right? She got to get off her horse. Yep. I have to go. Everybody's having horse issues. It seems to happen with the storms. That's the pig pen where they do all the hand-to-hand -hand combat if somebody has a disagreement. Or bored. Oh. What a little town this is. Yeah. Little town, big problems. <laughs> it seems to be. What I hear. Def definitely keeps us busy. That's where the blacksmith is. Nobody really owns that stable there, but the cattle rustlers out of Emerald bring their cows down here from time to time. We try to make sure it stays clear. It'd be nice to see a blacksmith in town. Drive some business in the economy. Oh, yeah, he's on occasion. Come and go. It's mainly get his supplies, you know what I mean? Everybody's having supply issues. These folks don't want to work. These folks need to get off their ass and do things. Yeah, well, the miners are having a hell of a job because of the price of pickaxes and then getting robbed every time they go mining. So they have fun with that. I like to check down here because this is our only cooking area until somebody opens the saloon. Oh, we can cook here? <laughs> Yep, at this pot here you can cook. If you need to. I do, a lot of bread. Well, there you go. All right. All righty. This way. 
Che always check this tent because people can hide in it. This one down here, this white one. Sheriff's office. Hmm? It's empty. But yeah, people come and do shit in here sometimes. I just, we've been told well before this whole KW business started up to make your presence known in town so people can't just think, oh, I'm not on Main Street, I can get away with anything crap. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's good to walk around. I mean, straight oh, yeah. Shit, I don't know why folks are staying in one spot. It's not oh, it drives me nuts. Yeah. If I do stables, I, I usually get on horseback and basically do the same route, but uh, go down to the telegram office, check there, and do the stables. and But basically, same route on horseback through the back of the buildings. <laughs> you know where the storage is here, yeah? Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah, I had to do six trips myself. I used to be a hunter out there in Strawberry. <laughs> I had a bunch of stuff to bring over. Oh, and they're asked us to check the church now, too. Sheriff's office, anybody about? It's clear. And you check both confession booths and check the the cemetery because there's holes over there people like to throw crap into. That's the foot patrol. <laughs> There you go. Oh. Yeah, right over here we found a body, one of the first victims of that KW in one of these holes. Oh. It's just good to check. And if they don't own the property, they can't be on the roof or second floor balcony. You have to ask don't them to get down. Do. Yep. It's just, we've had a lot of people pop arrows off and explode the lantern on the porch here. So we don't allow it anymore. It's pretty ridiculous. Yep. How we doing? Oh, yeah, you just check the roofs as you walk down Main Street. Usually ain't anybody up here. Uh, one of the gunsmiths, Apollo, he likes to sit on his roof, but he owns it. So, what do you do? Yeah, I'll walk down here and hang out at this junction for a couple minutes and then walk back up when we're stuck in town. Helps remind people to slow down when they get on Main Street. Main yeah. Street? You mean the only street? The, well, that's what they call it. It's all mud. 
Um, typically, you holler at them if they've speed past the storage. Anything after that, though, there's not much that you can do about it. Unless they're repeatedly speeding around back there, then you'll ask them to slow down. But let me put it in. I put it. We did the pink patrol. Now they call it. <laughs> Shit, I was just going to go on a walk and think we were going to do a sophisticated pre plane route. Yeah, well, they have it now. It used to just be foot patrol, but now they actually have a name to it. Let me check here, see if I have to do that. I know they had it written down somewhere in here. A patrol. Okay. Patrol. Probably de stress being stuck in that office. Yeah, I'm gonna go take a leak. I'll go do it. Yep. Back. Okay. Right. Walk in, walk out. Yeah, Ripley. Roll. Press. God damn it, where'd it go? Roll logs. I do this every time. Oh.
Are you trying to go in reverse? <laughs> Doing all right. Uh, all right. A lot of water in my system. All right. I left the mark back there. So. <laughs> all right. Where's, well, Nick, next, next, I'll go check the saloon on him. That's the area I saw him run into. How you doing? I don't see him. Monroe. No luck here. You said you had some stress or you're good right now? Ma'am. What doctor? Hey, yeah, good girl there. Yep. Yep. Figured as much. Are you seeing this wagon over here as well, or is it just my eyes? Oh, I see that wagon. Okay. Been trying to talk to that feller, but I can't seem to get much out of him. Hello? We'll keep What's up, going. Oh, shit. You're stuck there, huh? I reckon I'll probably head out of here. I ain't seen no gunsmith, so. Yeah, I'm... This is the old wagon he's on, huh? Oh, you can't see me? I see you. I see your wagon. But it's like it's going in reverse. Story at standing on that. Well, you know, this seat here is pretty comfy. It's got a nice cushion on it. Oh, there you go. How you doing, sir? I'm more or less just checking up, but I, I couldn't tell you when that gunsmith is going to be back, so. Yeah. yeah. Head back down south, but I appreciate y'all boys. Take it easy where, now. Where are you, hey, you from? Uh, Rose. Oh, wow. Oh, safe travel back. You too, buddy. Be safe. Oh, okay. Did I go? It's going. It's going. It's going. <laughs> you must be coming back from some night, huh? Uh, yeah, I was at a, uh, at a wedding. Oh, fancy. Yeah, it was pretty good. Let me just get changed. Yeah, we don't we don't stick in there very long if we can help it. Yeah. Uh, oh no. Where'd she go? She she was just she right go? here. Where'd she you see her? Hey, honestly, mate, like I wish I could show you that timing. What? What? She 
Is that her at the end of the street? She was just right here. I had never seen what, her like that. That was pop. something else. Yeah, she had pop. He was choking him out. He choked her out that hard. She had pop. Jesus of course. Christ. It was good timing. Um, yeah, Ripley, this is the other lieutenant. This is Jack Gray. Yeah, we met. Uh, is, they want to hide you on. Here you are. I was wondering, Monroe, if you had a minute, we can go on a little walk together. We can do, mate. Now that uh, Jack's around. Right, come on then. Let's go for a quick trot. I'll work down, Frank. Do you have a good shindig? <laughs> Um, it was good. It was good. There's a lot of people there, so you know the the issues that come from that. Obviously, was a bit annoying, but apart from that, it was alright. Right on. You see in the paper. Ah, uh, what? Law to law. Oh, uh, uh, Luca. Adam? Yeah. He's, he wasn't right. Yeah. That's what I woke up to. <laughs> Christ. Yeah, I was trying to... I've been trying for three days to get the strawberry to go see about a horse. But my horse is almost 22 now. <laughs> Every time I wake up from a nap, something's going on. It's too funny. Yeah, about that. Well, you know how it is. He didn't have a rank on his name on his uh, time card, so I just put Deputy Ripley. Is that okay? Assist yeah, he's Assistant Deputy. Oh, okay. Yeah. I couldn't tell with his coat if he had a tie or not. A blueberry or two here. Oh, damn horse is trying to run off. Over here. There we go. Hopefully, I can keep on the track for the chat better here. Awful.
Oh, that was different. <laughs> that wasn't the right one to do. And note, just note. Okay. S okay. Note. There it is. straight away so is Ali back yet nope nope did you bring home any other women nah just the one unfortunately all right well that's respectable you have one good lord okay Drake so I've seen the examples of you telegramming uh to New Hanover to New Hanover so are you, are you aware of like when it's appropriate to uh you know, all law on duty when it's appropriate to tag a department and how to send a telegram to a doctor. Correct. That's you need done. to be yeah. at a machine. I think a lot of folks misinterpret that. Yep, yeah, that's correct. Um, you probable cause and reasonable suspicion. From what it says here, you've got a firm understanding, so you know that you can't. So just like, I mean, it's, it's it's word for word in the training document, not to give you a, a hint, but if you could just let me know the difference between probable cause and reasonable suspicion. I'll tell you the same thing I told that sergeant there that I said I trained, which, again, that was my sarcasm, but uh, it was funny. But here we are. So, <laughs> reasonable suspicion, probable cause. Suspicion is exactly what it says. It's suspicious. You ride into town, you got a badge on, and a group of men start running running away. That's That's suspicious. But here's the deal, and here's, here's the reality of life, is anything suspicious. Shit, I mean, this man's long hair next to me is a little suspicious to me, but you know, I'll keep it between <laughs> myself and him. Anyway, <laughs> with criminal activity, though, that's not proof. Probable cause is your proof. That's your evidence. That's what can give you, that's what gives you justification to do your job, make an arrest, hold someone, search them, charge them. That's probable cause, such as you actually see a handoff of some form of illegal item Yep. And you go up and you approach the individual, detain them, and you, you take a look at the item. And it is an illegal item. There's your probable cause. That's your evidence. Nearly word for word, mate. Brilliant. So I'm happy after Herschel's already spoke to you about that and you just recited that perfectly. Happy to mark you off on that as well as your telegrams. Um, let me do that and then we'll talk about bolos. I don't think Riley kind of uh, got what I was talking about there, did he? What do you mean?
think the line's got a little bit mud that I'm muddled there with Riley. Um, hey, Doc. Weird. How is it mocking off, Ripley? Hello. How are you? I'm how doing all right. How are you doing? I'm doing all right. Okay. Train rain, not too bad. Um, not too bad. That's good. For some people, it might be bad, but um, mostly too Riley. bad. Could you give me a date and a time, or a few dates and a couple of times, for some first aid training? Please. Um, well, um, I'm thinking because um, this this week I um, decided that having six nightmares was a good idea. So I'm really not going to be awake this week. Um, let me... Reach out to Racy and see if she can host one. I don't really know any other doctors, but we'll we'll get it figured. I just wanted to ask you while you were here. That was always quick and easy. But if you if you're busy, doc, it's fine. Right. Um, uh, I have some time tomorrow. Uh, yeah. Uh, What's your stars? A couple of times. When's best for you? And I can put it to a um, vote for everyone. I'm in, I'm in the Eastern stars. So earlier in the Eastern stars time would be better. All right, so um, give me a few EST star times, Ali. Um, anything after, let's say, 1 p.m. EST. So if I put 1,300, 1,400, 1,500 and let them vote, yeah? Is that right? Yeah, that works. Run to the bank right quick. So up. Uh. Oh.
So basically after the afternoon storm tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's what I'd be about. I'm gonna go put that on the fucking office board quickly. What's that? First aid training tomorrow. Oh, perfect. Right. What do you reckon to that, Jack? That little note I left on the office board. Um. I was just about to say, you want to specify what times, but you can also do the following. What do you mean specify what times? The times are there. No, time zone. Uh, it's there. Yeah, I've yes. edited it. Here, let me show you something. What? What the fuck? You, there's always the ESP. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to do, um, I wanted to do one, two, three, which is easier, but it's not an option for voting. Yeah, go on. What's this? So open that. Yeah. Right down there. What you want to do? See where it says time zone. And jet to EST. Yeah. And then punch in the date and time that Ali said. So is it the 21st? Mm -hmm. Ali? 22nd. 22nd. So 22nd of whatever, blah, 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 blah. Like, and then. Yeah. And then you'll see that the thing will change. Yeah. Copy the third one from the bottom. Take that, like there should be a little uh, paper, what is it called, a clipboard thing in blue there on your on your page. Yeah. And then you just, and then just slip it in my pocket and you'll see. So you see how that says, what does that show for you? What does that say? Sunday, 22nd of January, 2023, 1800. Yep. So is that the correct time in EST? Uh, I think so. Yeah, it would be. So if you send that to Ali right now. She tell me what time she sees. The show it to her. What time does that say for you, Ali? Sunday, January twenty second, twenty twenty three at one p.m. So that's the right thing. Mhm. Mm so I see that as Monday, January twenty three, twenty twenty three, five a.m. So fancy. So it's all the same time, but whoever looks at it, it looks at it with their native time zone. Oh, that's neat. Yeah. So do that and then that way people can actually see it and vote for it so you can do it in brackets or whatever and then that ah i fucked it jack jack help <laughs> jack, jack. it's not gonna it's not gonna work if you have the um the square oh. boxes on it like the you know how we do reports and you put them in the box it won't work if you do it like that there it is All right, I think I fixed it. Is that better? Yep. Nice. And then what you want to do there, and then you add that thing that I just slipped in your pocket as well. Mean, how do you mean on that?
actually you actually got to tell her what the results are. At least let me know like two hours before one p.m. Um, Eastern stars, because I have like um the memory of a squirrel, and I'll probably forget. <laughs> No one's fucking voted on it yet. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, you want me to vote now? Suppressed. They don't read the bloody notice board. There you go. Usually a storm around that Just time, do I? Oh my oh. god, I'm so fucking dumb. <laughs> <sighs> right, what else was I doing? Ripley. You there, bud? Who are you talking to? Me? No, no this Ripley. fella over Sorry, here. I'm, I'm right here. Oh, okay. You have to change the nickname of your uh, office pet. Jack, where is the signing off of new trainings? The new one that was introduced. Um, got it. Any log? Just <laughs> read my head for a second. Mm -hmm. No worries. Cold. <laughs> Fuck me, I just want to have a breather for five minutes. So I've been doing paperwork for the past hour. Have we got an update on Luca? There's been no telegrams or anything. Yeah, Are we going around? We can run a green patrol. And if you want, link oh, rip. Link your mind um, the nonsense. Go for a piss. In fact, if, if you want to go, I'll stay here with Ali. All right. All right have fun, boys. Uh, we run patrols of my horse. I'm going to put my stuff in my, uh, in my thing. Oh, my goodness. Trot is there if you, if you need it, fellas. Oh, yeah, I believe mine's in the stable. I'll run you down the stable if you want. All right, I want to grab some water and wreck quick anyway. Got to put stuff in the uh, bank. All righty. No, we're ready. Chris. How you doing, sir? I'm just gonna go down to the stables and, and pull Jake's horse out, alright? While you grab any girth, please. Yep. Oh, I'll meet you down there. I, I heard you now. Heard the last bit of it. <laughs> How y'all doing? The hell is in there?
So pull it out twice, like in a row, just like pull it out, pull it out. Apparently that works. I see it. I can see your horse now. Oh, just disappeared. Ah, uh, disappeared. Fuck. No, nope, no dice, don't see it. Nope. I don't know how I ended up over there. How about now? Nope. nope. Okay, shit, get out of here, you. <laughs> Negative. We get it eventually. If you have to run down the hill and run back, sometimes that works. Fucking not. I'll do a lap around the barn after I flee him. See if that good people. Horse has been a real nightmare this since the storm. I had to take a nap twice before mine showed up properly. Yeah, just like a luck of the draw. I'll take a quick nap. I'll be no more than a couple minutes. No worries. Alrighty. I'm sad this one's getting up in age. It's been a good horse. Is that macadamia nut or? Mm -hmm. What's this one called? Uh, thoroughbred. His name's Pepper. Pepper. It. Yep. <laughs> He's a good horse. I had a Mustang before this, but he just liked to throw you or nip at other horses. He, he was just an ass all the way around. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. My last horse was a fucking cocksucker and a half. Her name was uh, Buttons, and she just loved to kick the shit out of assistant deputies, man. I tell you what, she used to beat the fuck out of assistant deputies. Yeah. She'd walk anywhere near her when she was hitched up, and she would kick the hell out of them. Yeah, horse trainer warned me about that, that females can be a bit testy in a crowd. <laughs> yeah, she, um... Buttons actually saved me one time. A criminal lassoed me off the horse, off of Buttons, and was reeling me in to hog tie me. And as he was going to hog tie me, Buttons kicked the shit out of him and kicked him, and I got up and shotgun him. Nice. Gentlemen, can you see and hear me? I see yeah, you. I see and hear you. Yeah, let me give the horse. All right, give it a shot. See the horse? Negatory. Oh, Jesus fuck. All right, let me. You're gone. Invisible. <laughs> Might have to ride him out to the rock and back. Sometimes that works. There he is. Beautiful. There it is. Yep. Go back uh, to the office to uh, check in and then I'll, I'll be set. Yeah, yep. we're right here. But I'm, I'm liking this third bread. Oh, yeah? Yeah. I keep up with Arabians and all that just fine when we're running down the railroad tracks. I don't understand. Why you spend all that money? Maybe the longevity of how long they could run. Yeah. Yeah. That's probably it. But this one's fully trained. It came with a saddle. All I had to do was add saddlebags and stuff. I got it for like seven fifty. Oh, fully. Yeah. So this fox rider costs like three and a half grand, and then plus like fucking seven hundred bucks of training. 
Yeah. I was with bull training and and the horse. Dropping. But he was already 17 now. All right. I can't right. afford a fancy so horse. You, uh, you know the patrol route, Drake? Mm, I think I got a note of it somewhere. I mean, All right. Do you okay. want to learn it uh, by like memory or do you want to learn it via the map? Or both. Uh, I could use the map as reference, I suppose, if that's the way you want to go. Well, I like to learn it just by visually knowing where to go. Um, and I can teach you like that. It'll take a little bit longer and it'll be a little bit more descriptive. But The longer away from overall, town, the better. Yeah, <laughs> Weapons out, sir. Excuse me. Overall, you will learn uh, where you are a lot better. You'll recognize places and things like that. I cannot afford a long arm quite yet, otherwise I'll have one. No, that's not good. What weapons do you have at the moment? I got my cattlemen's. Um, pull that, one of them out. Oh, I'll draw it when I need it. So, basically, um... You come Watch out yourself, the riders. The Howdy. Come out the back of the stables and head along towards Limpity. So you just follow this road out, and then there's a uh, right-hand turn that descends down the hill, and that's all we take the whole way down. So the way I try to teach people is like visually uh, remembering things. So here's the downhill turn. So we curve to the right and then just take this all the way down to the bottom of the hill. And that's at Limpany. So yeah, again, when uh, like, for example, a robbery will drop off. No, a lot of the deputies that I've personally trained won't need to check where to go on the map. They'll just see up Emerald, up Limpany, up Annisburg, and they'll just start riding there because they know, they actually know the, uh, the landscape, which is a much better way and can result in faster, uh, Response times. You just head all the way down the hill, and you'll see here we can see the lights of Limpany. Um, there's a grow field in this inter the corner of this intersection here, um, where people can grow all kinds of uh, plants. However, they can also grow swamp herbs. So a lot of our local population will pop over here, grow swamp herb, and then go back into town and come back 20 minutes later. So what we do is we actually skirt along the inside of this forest here because this is right at the edge of where they can, the fertile land is, and we just check the base of the trees that no one's growing swamp herb in the bushes or along the base of the trees. This is Limpany, basically exclusively used for robberies. Um, we'll just stop here really quickly and I'll give you a bit of a rundown on how um, robberies in Limpany work. So... Here's office. Usually there's a pretty interesting dynamic that exists with uh, robberies where... Um, during, if the robbery occurs during the day, if we have to breach, we have an advantage because we are in a, the light is outside of us and we're looking into a dark area. So it's easier for us to see, sorry, it's harder for us to see in, but it's easy for them to see out. So they have an advantage should we need to breach, but if we need to chase them, it's daylight and it's sunny. It's easier for us to see. Then come nighttime, it's harder for us to chase them. However, if we need to breach or need to get into a fight around the store, uh, they're in a well-lit room and we're in the dark outside so we can see in a lot better So there's a there's a balance that takes place and it's a decision I guess the criminals make or subconsciously make so just what something to keep in mind when there is a robbery about what time of day It is and what advantages we do and don't have however with Limpany It's a little bit more different and difficult because of these two gas lanterns that are here. Are they how we doing sir? Shine light on the um, on the window you and make it quite how you to actually see doing all right you don't know back windows. just doing patrol Ah, don't mind me. Chair's office. Yeah, don't mind me. Mind me. That. I'm just waiting for my, uh, cousin. Hello. Are you meeting out, meeting down here? Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. He was here and then he kind of, uh... Oh, gotcha. Yep, yep, yep. Well, you guys seen anything strange while you've been out here? No, no, just a bunch of howling coyotes that are fucking loud. That's about it. <laughs> Naturally. Just making sure nobody's giving y'all any troubles or anything. Oh, no, I mean, we appreciate that. Thank you. Yes, sir. And if you ever need anything, Valentine's Sheriff's Office up there, just up the hill there. Okay, perfect. Definitely. All right. All right. Take it easy. Same to you. What you do with the information is up to you and really depends on how good of a lawman you're going to end up being. So from here, we cut where this sheriff's office is, we cut right behind it, and there's this uh, steep uphill thing where we uh, we go up of and get up to Flatneck. You all right? Ow. 
in full speed and watch for fallen rocks one at a time back up back up get get a good speed to it oh you want a desperate huh <laughs> yeah get a good speed to it <laughs> there you go Oh, you'll enjoy um, our, our gold patrols then. We've got something called Jack's Crack, which is... Uh, slippery. It's uh, slippery as fuck. And, and yeah, it's, it's one of those ones where you can either take it slow and pick through, or you can, like, full gallop down, and uh, each has its pros and cons. This is mm -hmm. Flat Neck Station. Um, there used to be a lot more activity here. Uh, ranches... Sheriff's office. Looks clear. Because we've got the thanks, mate. Because we've got the train line um, back there that people often ride across, as well as like it's a pretty major crossing point. So sometimes we'll send people up here just to hang out and just to monitor traffic as it comes through. You know, good way to do some bandit interdiction and things like that. So from here we take the um, take this road down and basically follow it along until it takes us up to the train track where we turn and head to Emerald. Hmm. The things to be thinking of while we're uh, on patrol is um sorry i'm not on the road at all we'll go down there uh things to be thinking of is looking for smokestacks so big thick columns of smoke suggest that there could be potentially um a moonshine still in operation and things like that um which obviously we want to be aware of <laughs> as quickly as possible and be taking action towards that um as well as you know keeping note of people that is around so a good example of that is um, myself and aries we ran a patrol early today we bumped into four people. I just thought they were a little bit sus. They were all dressed exactly the same. Aries said that he'd seen them before wearing masks. Um, so I just jumped off my four horse and clipped the quick picture of them with my camera that I've got. And then two and a half hours later, I saw a bolo for those same people described um, for robbing someone in West Elizabeth. So I was able to send them that photo. Um, so it's just trying to be like forward thinking and, you know, we try to stop and talk to as many people as we can because it also extends, effectively extends our range of a patrol. So for example, if I talk to someone and they say they've just come from Rhodes and they say that the uh, the path there is safe and they haven't run across any, any bandits or anything like that, it's a pretty safe assumption that uh, road, you know, that pathway, that road to Rhodes is safe. So you've effectively increased your patrol radius just by speaking with someone. Now that information, you know, can sometimes be taken with a grain of salt and people do exaggerate things like that, but or for the most part, the you know, they say it's safe. Bandits themselves. Beg your pardon? I said, order the highwaymen themselves. Yeah, that's another possibility. And you will run into people that are sus that we can't really do anything against. So you're turning left here. So basically, you come up here, hit the train intersection, and turn left because over there it goes to roads. We will run into people, you know, in travels that you think it's sus and it's probably up to no good that you won't, you know, do anything about. So unfortunately, like those those guys in four men in white, I just thought they were really sus. You know, there's nothing, no crime that's been committed yet, but they probably will. So it's unfortunate. Is that their crook bed, the uh, border for Lemoyne? That's correct, yeah. Well, at least I know where it's at. But do you know what the rules are regarding, like, uh, crossing jurisdictions and things like that? Well, I got no business over there. It's not my, not my place unless I'm chasing someone that did a crime here. Yeah, that's exactly yep. right. So we have what's called the hot pursuit doctrine. So if we're in an active pursuit uh, for someone or, uh, like, actively searching for someone that we believe is going in that direction, uh, you can enter the jurisdiction without, you know, permission or anything like that and and continue to chase that person. Um, but in any other circumstances, basically, you need to send a telegram and just uh, get a, a quick OK back from them if you're in there. But you've got to keep in mind that while we, we are lawmen for the, for the Commonwealth, we our jurisdiction is New Hanover. So if you're deputised well, in New Hanover, you're not deputised in, in Le Moyne. Yeah, we're... we're, we're deputies for this year's sheriff we don't that's, we don't work for yes, any that's other exactly right sheriff. that's exactly right so that's when a lot of people forget that they think they're just lawmen turning left here so you're taking a left at the fork in the road i don't think folks understand that at all to be honest with you the way after some conversation uh well i'd love to hear about that if there's someone that needs to be reminded oh it's um, it's, it's not here so. riders yes, yeah there's there one up to the right there Daddy. Oh, they're peeling off i thought they were coming to us yeah sometimes 
Mm. Yeah, we didn't get it out in time before they booked it. Yeah, no, I mean, some people won't. You know, they might have like thousands of dollars on them that they might be trying to look after, and they'll just completely avoid. They don't even want the opportunity to talk. They won't. I don't blame them. Few places to check here. So this is obviously um, Emerald Ranch. There's a grow spot over behind. We the have area. a grower. Um, we always try to make an effort to get over here as much as we can because we want to protect our our humble farmers. This is the general store that gets robbed. Um, bit of a difficult one to breach because you can't see in very well. Um. But if you're negotiating or if you want to look inside, you can actually come up against this. Uh, you can look through the slats in the wood here to get a very limited vision. So usually you can't really see exactly what's going on, but you can see, uh, you know, how many people roughly. Sheriff's office. Sheriff's office, how are you going? Hello. I'm good. How are y'all doing? How y'all doing? Anyone giving you trouble today? Oh, no, no. Just out here doing some farming. That's good. Haven't seen anyone around we might be interested in? Nope, not at all. I haven't seen nobody. Y'all the first I've seen in a while. That's good, that's good. What's your name? Kiana. Nice to meet you, Kiana. I'm Jack. Nice to meet you, Jack. Kiana Kent. Right. Y'all are out Kiana of uh, Valentine? That's yes, ma'am. The Valentine Sheriff's Office. I appreciate y'all coming out here this evening. Y'all stay safe, all right? That's all good. You have a nice yes, day. Yes, ma'am. You as well. Thank you. If you need anything, let us know. I sure will. Thank you so, yeah, so much. Like the, Have a good night. Are a great way to lay out a community aspect and vibe. Um, you know, that's why we're why we're policing and why we're patrolling. We're, you know, people like her, right? Lone people that probably would get absolutely gobbled up and eaten by uh, by bandits. They're they're the people that we're trying to look after. And a big thing thing for me is looking after the little guy. You know. The farmers will provide for this fine commonwealth. Same exactly thing with right. the miners and lumber workers. Taking it right over here. Yeah, basically, I'm taking it right. Way and move mountains to make sure that um, honest living people are protected. Ryder. Sheriff's office, how's it going? Sheriff's office. You got your ears on? There you are. How are you going? Great. How's things, mate? Going well, sir. How about you? Not too bad. What are you worry up to today, plodding on? I'm walking to uh, Valentine's right now with Mr. Pickles Horse. See if he's around to get it back. Beautiful. I uh, I haven't been in town for a little bit, so I'm not sure if he's around. But um, yeah, well, haven't seen anyone we'd be interested in, mate. <clears throat> What'd you say? Haven't seen anyone acting suspiciously or anything like that. We might be interested in. Uh, no, I was I was on my I was by my house and uh, no one was around there. And Good then stuff. when I started walking, I haven't seen nothing, not a soul. Beautiful. All right, you have a nice day, my friend. All right, you guys as well. Have a good night. Over here to the oil fields now. You can see all these uh, the buffalo, or as, as Tal and I call them, furry money bags. Um, if you're ever strapped for cash, you can come out here and hunt them. They're worth ten bucks, ten bucks each, basically. Oh wow. Yeah. The, uh, the natives don't like you hunting them, but it's not illegal to do so. Just be careful if they're around, because they will fuck your day up. Uh, um, you got to be quicker at the draw than them. Yeah, exactly. Out here to our right is Traveler's Ranch. It used to be owned, not currently at the moment, so... You can kind of poke your head in there if you really feel like it. Not uh, not necessary at the moment, just because there's probably not going to be any activity up there. <laughs> if it were to be owned, we would include another patrol route and stop up there and check in on them. This is the oil refinery, or Cornwall Kerosene and Tar, I think it's called. Um, and this is where they do a lot of smelting and oil refining and stuff like that. So a lot of high value goods is exchanged through here. So you just cut right and go actually to the refinery. Um, oh shit. Cool. You all right? What the so shit? I don't know what happened. God damn. Yeah, I'm not oh. bloody hell, sorry. Um, yeah, so. Oh, oh. Here, we want to be uh, having a 
chat to him, suss him out, that kind of thing. Especially if you just see horses with no riders, you want to probably go in and, and have a look around, just make sure there's no one up to no good. The one thing of note here is there's some pretty aggressive locals that are uh, that are around. So for the most part, people as a general rule try to limit their uh, their time that they spend here. So, which is a little bit unfortunate. I would like to see it become a bit more of a hotspot, but uh, to say la vie. Yeah, it's also a good idea to put your uh, long arm away when you enter that place too. Sometimes the locals get pissed that you have it out. Yeah. Um, so that's our green patrol. That's when we try to run pretty regularly just because it's a nice like 10 minute ride, good break away from away from town, that kind of thing. So do you have any questions surrounding that or anything uh, with the pathway or things like that? Well, I got no questions on that. No worries. The other thing when we do patrols, we got to fill out a patrol log. Basically, it's just keep record keeping, keeping us uh, accountable, that kind of stuff. How we doing, Doc? How's things, Mr. James? Good. Good. Chat a couple of people to chat to, but apart from that, not much. No. Right, so, uh, when we come back. Oh, you beautiful Australian bitch. Oh, you didn't tell me there was a beautiful, well mustached lad in here. Some Valentine's gift your pocket and ask for it. Sorry, what? Let's fix it, then we'll find out if you. What the hell are you guys wearing? Uh, ponchos. What do you think we're fucking wearing? Why? Because we're sexy. Well, I can really fucking oh, say anybody yeah, yours. Hey, is that, a, uh, is that good? It is great. Is that fucking? It is fucking. How you doing? I'm doing all right, fucking. Hey, Jack, I heard you got something else for me. Oh, yeah. The uh, dead end of the stable? Yeah. And I gotta run to fucking Armadillo oh, with you. The best goddamn town in the world. What? I tell you what, boy. Yeah, I tell you what. You'll be begging to come back. Oh, I tell you what. I said you'll be begging to come back. <laughs> right, so, Ripley, if you want to, if you see the NHSO patrol record, <clears throat> the. In the newspaper, it's like a few down from your training thing. Oh, you want him to do it, or? I mean, you, oh, why was that? Was you done it, Jake? I was just going to do it because nobody said they were going to do it. No, no, we'll get Ripley to do it, and then I can mark him yellow for patrol. Already. So. Ripley, oh, I gotta turn my writing voice off. Sorry. No, you're all right. Essentially, Ripley, copy the um the format that was above previous. So the route that you did was the green route. Um, the number in party would be three. The leader, put yourself. And then any notes, you know, ran into a few farmers, anything that would have happened or did occur. What is going on down there? Nothing. Be in my... Oh. Be in my head in this for a second.
Another good habit to have is if you have to step away for a minute in your head to go in the office in case something goes down and you're not just sticking out for somebody to pop off on. Yeah, I figured I might go to the saloon or something while I write all this down, but I, I think I posted what I had to post. No, yeah, it's all good. Not not writing reports and stuff, no. like if you got to step away. You just need to essentially remember that green route. <clears throat> Um, and then you need to go on a gold route and then lead the patrol and you're good for that. We, oh, I, it, I was leading that green, or not green, uh, shit. You just said it. Uh, gold. The gold one. I was leading the gold one, but we came back because we had a robbery after we were halfway through it. Oh, uh, was that the moonshining incident? Or the, mm. no, the no, no, we had, a, we had a bank robbery. No, it was on the moonshine one. That was fun. I, was, I don't think you was with me on that one, but... No, I was there. It was a good time. There he is. Oh, yeah, no, man. That looks great. Nobody gave you any trouble on that one. The green route's real simple. The gold one's a pain in the ass, but... Just because it gets skinny in spots. A bit long winded, but they're both good routes. Your horse okay from them couple of tumbles? Yeah, I think so. I don't know. Let me, let me check on check on my poor fucker. Hold on. Oh, he's the boy. Let me get on you. Yeah, he's doing better now. Good. Up, probably. Oh, okay. It was just if you needed any apples or anything, I have some. Good Lord, how long you been here? What do you mean? Oh, with the with the new Hanover. Oh, a little over a week, I think. With New Hanover, how long you been? I think a week or week, week and a half, something like that. Almost got hired right when I did. Yeah. Well, you've been here a little longer than me. Not too long. The only reason I'm trying to get enough people on to do a mock robbery for the negotiations is the only thing holding me up to outright deputy. It goes quick, and it depends what what time you're able to be on, I think, more than anything. How we doing, ma'am? Not bad. <laughs> oh, your book's sticking out of you, bud. Lord. There you go. Good to go. What made you want to work for Valentine? Um, well, availability, really. I was a farm or a hunter out of strawberry. I used to hunt north of strawberry. I was sick of seeing for. Oh, what's this? Um, Local business? Yeah. All right. Another one watch this. Yeah, they get ornery sometimes. I don't understand how people set them off. I've never managed to do it. The ones at the store are too so close. easy. If you stand too close to him, you get there. Use a fillet. 
got plenty of room. Good lord. I'm trying to get Welcome you a piece. Play. Just let me out of the wagon. Oh, you found Luca. The found fucking Luca. Yep. Uh, we need Ali. Oh we need the doc. Yeah, okay, I'll go get her. How's everybody? Doc. My, uh, my brother here. He's he Ali, fell the found Ali. Oh, she has. We need, we need you, Ali. Uh, I have a patient. Uh, on my After your patient. Yep. Yeah, after him. No, Luke is the one in the wagon. He's the one that took off from us. Yeah, they just brought him in. I'm tired, and yeah. the other one is an assistant. Yeah, and the assistant was well, the one who actually Where's Monroe? Um, Let's get you into the office. Where's Monroe? Is James somewhere here? Yeah, he went to talk to Doc. Doc wants to see Luca. Come on, Adam. Let's get you into the office. Don't want to have to handcuff him. They want to see you. They're concerned about you. In you go. Should I go behind that door? I'm not coming out until that killer comes out. And I have Into to. Into the go office. Out. Come on. Let's go. You have to let me go. Adam, into the office. The hell is them? Um, fellers have found Luca. They work for us. Well, they were a different parish, probably. No. He could be in the could be in the doctor's office. Who's that? Luca. Luca's in the office in here. We He's in here. Is back. He? Yeah, we're from LSO. Yeah, we, thank you we, guys. Yeah, we'll we'll get the doc over. over. The doctor's uh, dealing with a patient right now and then we're gonna have to figure out what no, to right. do with Luca. We don't know. Was he <laughs> is he acting weird with you guys saying anything? Yeah, well he was eyeing the horses when they were bringing him around. They had to force him in there. Was he acting strange with you guys? Anything like Sorry, make a peculiar you know, I mean I mean hell he rode through town fast as hell. We had to chase him at last him off his horse. So yeah. I tried opening that side door for him he's been, again, um, but y'all wanna go in the front. So he's been medically signed off. Because apparently he's lost all memory. He only recognizes a few familiar faces. Uh huh. And he's hell bent on finding this KW killer, but we need to find out like a doctor's yeah, opinion on what the. Yes, in the yeah, office. Hello. Uh, we found, we found Luca. Y'all gotta find him. You got it? Okay. When? Have the doc check him over here. Appreciate y'all bringing him in. I was talking to Annabelle and I saw the horrors and Lenny was like slow down and I looked and I saw the pants and the shirt and I walked up and I was like Luca and then he started running so we were like okay that's Luca so we chased him and we had to rope him off the horse because he, yeah. he wasn't stopping uh, and, uh, well we're just thinking about it. yeah he, he he just looks like he wants to run every moment that he can yeah and he's really afraid of being and bars, but you know, I said for your own safety, just go back and show your face and tell them you're okay. Because I said this is not the right thing to do. Yeah. And even you know, even though you think it is, it's 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 gonna kill you. Well, we were chase chasing him around out there for a while, but we we're afraid to lasso him with his injury, brain injury he had. Yeah, we, we didn't had know no if it was a good idea. Yeah. 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 We have no choice. I'm so sorry. Yes. How can we help? Is Ali, the doctor in there, I'm an intern. Yep. I just want to take notes. Oh, okay. Thank you. You're a man of your word. Go ahead and step in. I'll lock it behind you. Oh, it's not that far. Well, I ain't never been down there. I heard there's a big city down there. I try to avoid that part. Oh, say to D? Yeah. That place gives me the creeps, man. Yeah, say to D is, uh... Yeah. 
I'm still recovering from from some uh, broken ribs down there in St. Denis. St. Denis is a hell of a city, to say the least. We had to take somebody down there, and they tried to rob us in the bar down there in uniform. Oh, yeah, that happens. <laughs> Saint, you know Saint Denis isn't even our jurisdiction. No, yeah, they yeah. they need their own, and I think they need twice the manpower. If you ask me, there's so much places you could hide around in there. So you know, before the Great Depression, it actually used to be um, LSO jurisdiction. Oh goodness! Yeah, they never yeah. had a police chief or a police department. Uh, nope, now they do. That's good. In theory, that should help that sheriff out a lot more. I hope so. In theory, yeah. <laughs> no, but my question is, is it? Well. <laughs> I'm just going to give it a uh, no comment. Yeah. You know uh, Sparrow here used to work for SBCD. I'm sorry. And before that, oh. she was VSO. Oh, was she? she was uh, yeah, I, should, VSO. I should take a step back. My name is Drake Ripley. I'm new here, and I'm new well here in general, so I don't know shit about that stuff. I had to get used to how busy this place was. I used to hunt north of Strawberry. Yeah, I see people, I go the opposite direction. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I might as well introduce myself. I'm going to be Corporal Linwood Hash with the Moines Sheriff's Office. Well, congratulations. I am Corporal Sparrow from the Moines. Sparrow. Uh, you might as well start calling yourself Sergeant Sparrow. <laughs> no. Oh. Just tie in. I, I, I don't want to run in front of my feet, okay? That's bad for people. That's really bad, Lenny, because if you do that... You're gonna trip yourself, and then you'll never get back. Cause your feet are already running away from you. I uh, yeah no. I but, feel uh, so bad for roping him off. I just uh, <laughs> oh we had no choice. Both of y'all are assistant deputies here. Say again. I said both of y'all are assistant deputies here. Y yes sir. Oh. Okay. Y'all have joined a great department. Yes sir. Y'all's uh, sheriff used to be a lieutenant over at LSO. And uh, I think your under sheriff used to be either a lieutenant or a captain That's at captain. LSO as well. Yeah. yeah. Interesting. Uh huh. Well, I'm not a good people. Nor do I really give a shit about that shit, but. Um, <laughs> all I know is that I, I, I've already expressed my opinion, then lots of things. They didn't like my blue jeans, for one. Well, we compromised, so here I am. Our black jeans. Better than nothing? Mm -hmm. I mean, hell, I wear all leather, so. Good <laughs> Lord, what it's you all. shouldn't have yeah. said nothing. God damn, yeah, you do. <laughs> are those chaps oh, over man. your pants? They are or are those your pants? These they're are just the way chap the pants, pants look. Chap pants. pants? Yeah, they're like, they look like oh. chaps, but they're actually leather pants. Made. I feel sorry for your ass. Away. Yeah, just, yeah. Does he have an ass in the chest? Yes, he probably does. <laughs> I can't see it. Trust me, so, you should um, hear me after. Oh, uh, by the way, you're welcome. Um, this is thanks. Only $50 for the both. Well, actually, uh, 150 for the both. You know, yeah, 50 per person. So, um, yeah, well, we, del we delivery fee. Delivery oh, fee. I don't, I don't, I'm not hurting for money. I don't give a shit. Hey, about. Ripley, just want to give you a heads up. Um, I checked the clocking card. You've signed it, ass deputy. Um, Ooh. It's not as bad. You know, Sparrow, you know Luca, the guy you just brought back? When we <laughs> hired him, he signed his clocking card, ass deep, Adam Luca. Like, hmm. that, yes. <laughs> oh. Oh, my. Yeah. I mean, Drake's, Drake's is pretty close. Ass deputy. <laughs> Someone, someone, I forgot which one y'all told me to. So someone said I gotta have that, so I put it in. A S S T dot, not A S S. Oh. Ashless chaps, ass. I don't know what's in my mind right now. Yeah, so, uh, wait, where's Jack? Uh, not sure. Probably in the with the dog. Just wave a can of VB around in the air. He'll turn up. Well, uh, anyways, is a. I think y'all got it locked down over here. We have. Yeah. Oh yeah. Man. All right. Appreciate it. There that said that they're not going to release no him for an hour or two just to evaluate him or something. I don't know. They're doing that doctor yeah. shit. Let well, us know if you uh, need anything else. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Right right He's probably not going to run back the road, so next yeah. he'll probably go to like a strawberry armadillo. He wants to catch that killer on his own. 
Yeah, why did I mean? Does he walk around Saint Denis? Because he I doesn't. Mean... He doesn't really remember much about anyone, let alone who he is. He just knows that he's yeah. a lawman, but he doesn't know that he's medically signed off. He's a bit fucked. Yeah, he in the he, head. he he wants to find him, and he was really aiming for that. And we were like, "We just get you home." Like, just he's be not, fine. He doesn't know when he last slept. Last left. Slept. Sorry, he doesn't know the last um, time he well, slept. Well, he told us five days ago. Fucking hell. And he, yeah, he looks like shit. That's what I can say. He looks tired and he needs to take a nap. Yeah. And he's really scared of being put behind bars because we, uh, well, we had to do anything to get him, like, with us. So rope him up, put him in cars, and put him in the, in the jail. In the wagon, so yeah, he's kind of afraid to be put behind bars just because what he did. I don't know what he did, but you know. <laughs> no, it's just he ran from us. Yeah. That's what we did. We were trying to convince him not to go, and uh, he, he he did a runner. And it kind of got to the point where we didn't want to endanger us or him because he was acting really erratic. So we didn't want him trying to fucking shoot us or something. So we just thought best to pull back and put out the bolo. And hopefully he didn't cause any trouble. We just kind of, you know, you just think like maybe if you leave it, sometimes it's better to walk away as opposed to keep poking the fire. Uh huh. That's why we kind of pulled off and left him to it. Because he yeah. got to the yeah. Yeah, we saw him and um, you know he Lenny was like stop speeding in town and I was like wait who's that? And then when I said his name he, he ran off. So we were like okay we'll just get him because you guys know more than us and if we see him and we you know. That's the only information we have, and you really want to find him because you're concerned. It's the best way to just bring him back. Cause... Yeah. You know. I appreciate it. Be safe Thank now. You. Thank you, you Sparrow. Are. We definitely owe you one, darling. <laughs> you owe me nothing. Only a bath. And 150, I'll apparently. I'll pay for a bath. You want a deluxe cause... bath? You get 35 It's $35 for a deluxe bath. Because I don't know what happened, but the assistant tried to lasso him. He fell. Then Lenny tried to lasso him. Lasso me. We both fell. Sparrow, and now we're why are you up. telling people this? <laughs> I love being ashamed of our own department. <laughs> Told him this. So the price of this transport is that you never speak what she just said to me again. Okay. Sounds good. Well, this is all right. <laughs> we brought him back. That's all that matters. <laughs> Hmm. Right, well, uh, okay, fine. Where's, where's fucking Jack going with the marshals? Bye bye. Bye bye. Take it easy. Be safe. Fuck are they up to? I hate my horse being there. <laughs> it's gonna be a pain in the ass to get this out of here. No wonder there's no one here. What's up? No, well, Jake... I think it went back down to 80. But, uh, yeah, yeah. What's your train ticket like, Jake? Is it silver? Or is it gold? Yes, sir. Yeah, uh, yeah. I've tried many different ones, but that's the only one that seems to give me half a chance. Yeah, my silver as well. Just, you know, I'm a big fan of cutting the queue, so fuck it. So oh, yeah. Do me. Well, I figured if I was going to get a real job, I might want to have a, a good ticket. Yeah, but well, that's the native twins. Adar and Solis. They don't cause trouble. Who's that? I don't recognize her. Oh, it's Ava, I think. We got some older lady in town, too, in a fancy hat. Oh, uh, she wearing all blue, pink mask. Yep. Have fun with that one. I'm assigning you two with that one. <laughs> she can be a handful sometimes. She called me sweetie and rode away. Hi, sweetie. Yeah. That's her nag down yonder way. <laughs> oh, fuck's sake. <sighs> Oh, Lordy. Good Lord. Amen.
amen to that. Oh, I'll be right back. I do appreciate you being worried about me, but there's more Stop things to. happening bigger than me. It's doctor's orders, man. You wanted me to like, throw you off the back of that horse. I said no. No, I'm not. It's I'm, just I'm just trying to catch up on this. You can't see Look, Monroe, I'm going to be honest with you, Monroe. I'm going to uh -huh. get out of here one way or another. <laughs> You'll be the fuck out of you, Luca. I mean, you know you will. Just because you're down. Hey, Atlas. Back at it. Here. Okay. <sighs> What's up? What are they? Oh, they let her do the choice. I like them both. <sighs> All right, they miss anything? Um, yeah, let me fill you in. What's up? And that's about it. Oh, woo. And sometimes it gets, always gives me the creeps when it's quiet here because that means something else is about to go down. Mm. Well, I got to go to the bank right quick. You need to do it yourself? I always, always try not to keep over 20 in my pockets in case... Somebody decides to nab a deputy. They like to steal your shit. <laughs> he says what has been told to me. How you doing, ma'am? Oops, sorry. All right. I got cookies. Whenever you want to go walk about, let me know. I don't mind. Well, let's do a quick walk around. Oh, already? Jake, right? Yes, sir. I know I'm asking a million times, but it's all good. Names. 
Yeah, hey, me too, neither. Well, I'm a drink, so you're Jake. That's all I remember. There you go. I'm going to look in here right quick. Sometimes you have a down local, local in here. They like to fight each other, the locals. In here. Hey, how you doing, ma'am? I'm doing okay, thanks. Alright, so... What's up? Well, it's got a lot on my mind. I just like to think. Sorry if I'm thinking out loud. Can you guys uh, see my horse? Yeah, you're good. Yep, you're good to go. What's on your mind there? I got the job offer for West Elizabeth. Oh. I got friends there. Mm hmm. I don't know anybody here. Okay. Didn't you come from Wesso or? Nope. No, that was somebody else. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm not good with names either. <laughs> That's all right. Thinking I might just. Go out there, uh, lieutenant or whoever, and let mm -hmm. know I'm gonna appreciate the time here and the training y'all gave me. But I think yes, I'm sir. Gonna venture elsewhere. Oh, okay. Yeah, well, if you're honest and upfront about it, they put in a good word for you, and you might since you're already part of this department, I have to go through a transfer process. It's not just simple. Quit one go the other you have to have approval from both departments have a I feel deal like, i feel like you need the approval if you want to just move but i'm not just moving i just give them the badge here and go down there and say i'll accept the job that you're offering me yeah but no i'm saying since you're already part of it i don't know how that works i feel like pretty easy you just quit yep. the next job yep. i'd talk to him about it how y'all doing Howdy. hello ma'am oh hey there now you all got something what you got going on? Oh, uh, well, somebody's taking a look at the camera. What do you, what do you mean? Well, there's a Wait. camera inside. Okay. <laughs> what? <laughs> They're looking at it, that's all. Well, we was, so there was a, uh, there was a hole down up the street now. Mm -hmm. And I don't know if y'all saw in there, but... It's a hole that leads down to a decapitated body with no limbs and the yeah. torso such ripped open like. And, okay. And Excuse me? Have y'all not seen this? Oh, it was. It's just outside of town. It's really close. It's, it's extremely close. It looks like an absolute crime scene. I mean, there's bloody, there's blood on the walls, splatters all about. In, in, in. Oh, is that where that, uh, there's no building, it's just a hole in the ground? That's right. Yes, ma'am. Yes. Yeah, we just came across that, and there, and inside there was a camera. Ah. Uh, we was wondering if maybe this, this studio here was displaying the films that was taken in there as such, but. It's no, I don't think so. Checks out all right. There, there ain't such unsavory stuff unfolding here. <laughs> no. Yeah, that place is weird. Hey, sure. <laughs> Well, I, I would, I would actually, I would actually say stay away from that place. It's known to have snakes around it. Snakes. Yep. Oh, I hate snakes. All right, that's good advice. <laughs> yeah. I don't plan on going back. <laughs> don't worry about that. Snakes or not, it was, it was uncomfortable. Yeah. yeah I don't think I'll ever go back there. Well, I'll just give you a heads up. Well, if y'all ever need anything, we're sheriff's department here in town. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah, for sure. And we usually don't see people standing about the tent. That's why we're asking what's going on. I'm not oh, trying to give you a hard time or nothing. Oh, sure, I understand. Oh, yeah, yeah absolutely. All right, well. Good. Hopefully some films will play here someday. That'd be nice. I don't know. That'd be so nice. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yes. Maybe a little of this Josiah Blackwater. <laughs> <laughs> Perhaps. <laughs> you never know. All right.
Well, y'all have a good day. You hey, as well. well. Thank you. Right, thank catch y'all later. Where the hell are we walking now? Up the back road here. But yeah, man, and if just talk talk to LT about it, he'll know the proper way of going about it. I don't know the whole politicking side of this shit, so I couldn't tell you. Yeah, and that's what I was explaining to him. I said that's a whole separate job from this. Oh yeah. I'm transferring, I'm quitting and going over there and accepting a job. It's it's, it's yeah. It's not. I don't need approval for that. If I wanted to transfer into another position, I'm I'm sure there's a there's a process for that, but I ain't doing that. Yeah, I'm not sure. I don't know. I know a deputy wanted to be transferred over here, and there was a whole paperwork and bullshit involved. And uh, yeah, I don't know. But yeah, we'll talk to him about it. Oh. Let him know you do have a position available there for you. It's not like you're just guessing. Hey. hey, how are you doing? All right, man. <laughs> trying to fucking sort this shit out with Luca. Yeah, how's he doing in there? He's over there. He's over there at that tree, look. Yeah, it's all. Let him go for a walk, and he's not done a runner yet. Mm. Just trying to figure out what to do with him, because the doctors want to send him to Sisica for a few days, so he can't escape and do anything daft to hurt himself or others. But me and Jack are just trying to figure out the logistics of sending a lawman to Sisica because that would mean that you're unfit to be a lawman. Yeah. So it's a catch-22. Do we send him for his own good under the medical guise of mental health? Or do we let him, you know, just roam around freely to go be a vigilante and hunt this killer on his own, potentially putting his own life and the lives of others at risk? Fuck this job sometimes, James. Honestly, mate, fuck this. You know what I mean? And then I've got people fucking coming up to me asking me stupid questions. Where do I buy bread? And I'm like, I've got shit to do. <sighs> kind of need to speak to Ali without Luke <laughs> present. Hey, Jake, you want a job? What's that? <laughs> Distract Luca long enough so that we can speak to Ali without him being there. Oh, where's her assistant? <laughs> uh, where is Atlas actually? You Swiss cunt. Hey, bud, you want to fix your uh, your patrol record so it doesn't say ass deputy? <laughs> oh, does it say ass deputy? Yeah. Well, I don't know how you fix that. How you fix the role? Hmm? His uh, his. His deputy thing says ass deputy instead of assistant deputy. <laughs> you have to, um, you have to, like, oh, there's no way of fucking saying this. Yeah, ah. Uh. Just change it to, <laughs> yeah. yeah, there you go. There it is. Okay. <laughs> okay. I just didn't want it. people to give you a hard time about that. Just remember to clock off when you finished and you tell Atlas. We need you to go get, like, distract Luca and send Ali over to us so we can talk to Ali. Yeah, just tell her that, tell her that Jack and James needs to talk to her. <laughs> That's a fucking Luca. To, oh, what do we do? It's a talking, shit sandwich. LSO as well, and apparently he tried to run from Sparrow. Yep. And apparently he was being crazy with them as well. Whole clip through town multiple times, wouldn't listen. Yeah. Had to be hogtied. Had to be hogtied and put in the back of a wagon. They fucking threw him in here. Yep. In a wagon. And when he came around the way here, they were trying to. They had to tell him to leave the horses alone because he was eyeing the horses. And then oh, is, tell him like six times to get into <sighs> the office. Big sigh. I know, mate. Big sigh. Ali, what, what, what are we I'm doing? Thinking. If we well, where's he at? Tell me yeah. where he's at. Yeah. He's, he's right there. He's actively trying to run away from me. Um, he's not admitting it, but he's trying to get me to pull my horse out. 
two the, quote unquote book edits. Uh, the problem is, Ali, if we send him to Sissica, we are sending a lawman to Sissica, which means he is on the fit to be a lawman. Oh, that's fair as shit. I know. Um, um, it, boils down, it boils down to this, Ali, basically. Based on your medical opinion, do you believe that he's fit to continue work as a lawman? Right now? No. Okay, <laughs> what circumstances would allow that to happen? So he's still healing. That's the thing. He's saying that his memories are slowly coming back, so I'm not able to actually determine when they'll come back and if they come back. That's the thing with a brain but, injury. <clears throat> kind of. So you think, your professional opinion, that he would be safer for the public and himself if he is in Sissica? Not so much the public. He's not a harm to us. I'm just worried about him. He... He's hell-bent on finding this killer. And what right. if he finds the wrong person and... Kills, you know what I mean? Yes. Yeah. If he fucking thinks it's me and he comes after me or he thinks it's fucking Jack, you know what I mean? I, I mean, you, you heard him earlier, didn't you? But we need something absolutely rock solid that we can take to a marshal or take to the sheriff or whoever and say, look, we have put a corporal in Sissica for three days to recover or X, Y, Z under, under the medical guise of mental health from senior doctor Ali. You know what I mean? We need it. We need our fucking tip top for this. Yeah. So if you're saying Sissica, we can take that further up and we can do that. I'm, uh, see, that's my thing. Sissica is the only secure place that he can't escape out of. Yeah. Well, in other places, my thing hey, is. Hey, guys, just I lock him in the back room of the medical center. I feel like. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that what we do in this day and age? You just strap him down. Can't, can't, yeah, can't, yeah, can no. I restrain him? Just, you send I him. mean, that's, that's all you guys. It's not us. That way I mean, it doesn't get our hands dirty. That gets my hands dirty, though. Yeah, that's better for me. Not better for me, yeah. She has to feed them and stuff. I have also um, management in the doctor's office, and I'm, I really don't want my hands dirty. By keeping a man locked up in our doctor. So, boys, it looks like we're going to have to pin him the fuck down, throw him in a wagon, and take him there his own good. I don't... Uh, that's... I, I, oh. I don't think Sissica is oh. the safest place Jake, for him to be um, right uh, now. Let's go on patrol, bud. Yeah. You Put patrol. Remember, be smart about it. Yep. Yeah. Good luck, boys. Someone's dealing drugs in Valentine. Good. Just looking all those nooks and crannies. I bet it's those bunch down at the tent, huh? Oh, yeah. But you never know. Next saloon. We're on back. How we doing today? Hello, hello. Uh, hello. How y'all doing? How are you? I'm good. How are you? Not bad at all. I a new haircut because I had a quiff and I didn't like it. No. Oh. <laughs> yeah. It's expensive. Yeah. I can't, I I can't, I can't, I can't believe how much. And it was 11 bucks. So I'm not too well, that's not too bad. bad. Yeah. It's over 20 down there. Yeah. It depends what you get. It was like one of them. They wanted $30 for him. Like, my hair ain't that fancy. <laughs> you don't, don't mind us wearing our masks around here, do you? It's just because of our um, Yeah, I don't know. My higher-ups might get after you about it. I'll fair warn you. Because they had... They had a... Uh, well, which tribe was it? One of the tribes axed down a... Probably the, come, probably the Comanche. Yeah, they uh, axed him down in the middle of the street in front of everybody. Uh, so they might give you issues. I'm just fair warn you on that. Yeah, but uh, we're we're leaving now anyway. We don't really yep. come here after it. So. Yep, it's all good. How you doing, sir? Well, Who's this buddy? Friend of yours? Uh, no, no. <laughs> not one of ours. <laughs> you all right there? Well, uh, there. We'll leave you with him. Bro. Yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, if you guys are leaving, you'll have a good day and be safe out there. Oh, thank you. You too. <laughs> I like your bow. Improved bow. The best one on the market. Oh, wow. Yeah, hey, I have the Cougar Paw one. <laughs> oh, I like that one. I feel like everyone has it. It's a bit popular. Yeah, I just got it on a deal because the gunsmith said he kept feeling like he was going to get robbed, so he wanted to get rid of it. <laughs> I don't blame them. Yeah, so. Yep. 
Colt Williams had that one. Sure. Yeah, yep, yep, yep. Yeah. He said he was sick of people uh, side eyeing the bow, so he wanted a, yeah. something a little less flashy. I haven't been been that way in a while. Been that way in a while. We, we uh, the tribe we're at is up in the snow, so um. Oh, okay. Strawberry maze leads, uh, Which tribe do y'all part of, if you don't mind me asking? Seneca. Oh, Seneca, okay. Yeah, I'd, uh, I do horse, I, I got my horse from the Comanche, or no, Choctaw up there. Choctaw, Choctaw that's yeah, it. So yep, yep, yep. A, uh, uh, Mountain track. It's like a subsection of Choctaw. Oh, okay. Some people that were in Choctaw and just left and decided to make their own tribe, so. Yeah, and you're more of the mountain types, yep, if I remember correctly. I do too, sir. I had to get used to this town. Get used to people. Yeah. <laughs> I used to hunt up Mount Sean area. It's not snow, but it's pretty up there. A mountain's a mountain, I suppose. Oh, yeah. But I don't want to hold you all up and let you all have, get on your way. Yeah, um. Yeah, and if you need anything, we're right up there at the end of the street. You see those pack of horses? That's the sheriff's office. If you guys ever need anything when you're down here, let me know. Oh, oh I don't know if you know, but that was a seven so new Moscow. That's how we used it. was just a massive shootout there. Oh, jeez. Um, not involving us, but the guys are wearing all white. And I saw them earlier today in Valentine. They were down yeah. By wagon. We saw, we got a report that there were. Uh, Emerald a couple hours ago as well. We're trying to keep tabs on them. Mm -hmm. So. Uh, what I can't hear is strawberry, strawberry sheriffs in the jail cells because they were mm -hmm. shot by Mika, one of our tribe's people. Ah, jeez. They, they decided to start a fight with the wrong people. That's for sure. Yeah, it happened. I don't understand why people can't just talk it out, but I understand that everybody's got a heated one. You can't help it. <laughs> Both sides. They well, we better go back to the snow yep. before they start wondering where we've gone. So. Yeah, no worries. I'm sure I'll see you around. Yep. Uh, Elwood, by the way, if you ever need anything. Nice to meet you, Elwood. All right. You have a good day, sir. You too. See ya. Where the hell is this idiot? There you go. Nope, that's the local. Yeah. Bedtime, kiddo. There you are. AJ. <laughs> Yeah. He's gone. Who's gone? The man. He's gone. Okay. So, uh, I seen it, but he was too far away. Yeah. And he got a source and just, like, you can't see him anymore when he gets on a source. He's that kind of person. Yep. So, that's kind of, yeah. There's no, we can't do nothing if we ain't got him, you know. No. It sucks. I got held up. Oh, yeah. I got held up by some natives in there, seeing what they were up to. And so, sorry about that. No, you're all good. I think uh, I think I'll pull Jack aside, Jack yep. Ray aside, and have that conversation with him. Yeah, I would. Sooner, better, and later. Well, you know. It was a pleasure to work with you today. Hey, man, not a problem, man. If you ever need anything, let me know. Absolutely. I'll be in Blackwater. <laughs> Superstition. <laughs> is, uh, is Jack still around? Uh, Jack's just gone into the office, mate. So yeah, we need to kind of... Uh, can we not fucking stick him somewhere? What about your house? Let's put him in your house for two days. We can put, we can put him in my house. Well, 
that's that's what yeah, where's Jack? Jack <laughs> I can't. Jack. Jack Jack Jack, don't leave me, Jack. <laughs> oh god. Freaking Titanic reference. <laughs> Well, he's busy. I'll give him time. Told him to come find me. Yep, yep. Well, you want to finish that route anyway, since we're halfway through it, or oh, since we're waiting on him anyway? Oh, okay. Did you check that tent where those people went? Those... Yeah, that's what I was thinking. No, I was just sussing out the people that were in the saloon. Making sure they weren't part of anything. I don't know if you heard me or not. Yeah, I'm uh, sorry. I lost my own thought. I apologize. No, no, it's all good. I just don't try not to talk too loud in town. Voice echoes. Yeah, no, I talk at a quarter, if you know what I mean. Yep. What's this yeah, fella up talk, to? Quietly, I talk to a mini school. <laughs> How you doing, sir? Oh, this... How you doing? Got your ears on now, or are you you okay? He was in the saloon. Hello? If you're trying to talk, sir, we can't hear you. Rand, can you hear me? He's off in his own head. All right. Well, he ain't hurting nobody. Not much we could do about that. But yeah, you said you went down to the stables and stuff? Yep. Alrighty. Yeah, next time we... No, oh, nice. Nice. They might holler at you if you're too far away by yourself right now since one of ours did get kidnapped by that feller. All right, let's look around, make sure they weren't stashing anything in here. Looks clear. All right, well, since you already cleared everything else, we got to head back now. Go up the back road here and back around. And if you want to, you can ride out the foot patrol this time. Have you been riding then? Yep. No, they have it as a marked. Yeah, since they have it as a marked route now, I figured it has to be written. You know what I mean? Before it was just going foot patrol, but now that they have it, it's a dedicated route. You know I'm just I'm from when you get back on patrol, you say I'm back. And that's yep. Yep. <laughs> I don't know. It's fresh. I don't know how they want to do it. They might tell me stop doing it, but until then, I'm not not doing it. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. Cover your ass. Cover your ass type of deal. <laughs> oh, what's this? We all good here? Got some chips. Do you want to come lay down in the back of the office, Adam? Just trying to figure out what to do with you, Luca. Come on. It's not that hard, man. You just, you know, you could let me go. Can't let you go. We can't do that, mate. For your own safety. We all love you too much. We're trying to help you, Luca. Sorry, Ruffin. Nah, maybe later. Mm. Mm -hmm. Squeeze, squeeze. Pet, pet, pet. Rupert, blood, snugs. Good snugs. Smooch it. So, boys, we figured out and what we're going to do with him, right? So, I regardless of what we were going to do. I love you. 
Have good uh, sleep. Me and Jack are 99% sure that if we were to send him on Sissica on a medical... I'll go anywhere else, but then I'm not going to get locked in between. Oh, you know what? You I'm not going to go somewhere else. Oh, hell. I will not lock the door. What about the saloon? Come on, just come take a look at it. One way in, one way out. I'll de-stress him a bit. Yes, yeah, so if we send him to Sissica, right, regardless of on the terms of what we send him for... Yeah, it's... Of, you're uh, nerfing his career, aren't you? Basically. Yeah. Like, I found a list. The doctors here found a list. Some of the reasons for admission to an asylum from 1864 to 1889, all right? So it's a little bit old. But some of the things on these lists, novel reading, time of life. Cisco is a penitentiary. That is where exactly. people go when they're condemned by the judge. Exactly. Yeah. So we don't have we don't have the facilities for an asylum. So it's Cisco mm. or nothing. So what we're thinking is Ali owns a little piece of land just west of Emerald Ranch. It's pretty remote. It's you know a nice little cabin uh, in the woods. Fresh air. We can just get Luca there. And make sure he checks in once a day. Maybe we can meet him in Emerald. Or, or yeah. if he wants to just, you know what I mean? Yeah. Anywhere that's not Cisco, because we don't want to kill his career. Yeah, I was kind of afraid of that. This is big time, whether you're any way you look at it. Does she have any idea when it is, he'll tighten up? Oh. Something happened. Just give me one sec, man. Yep. Probably stressed out being in there that long. Where's the assistant off to in such a hurry, though? Anybody with the dog? Get a few blueberries here. Hey, you got your ears on? Mm -hmm. 
Got a guy acting weird in the graveyard up here. Yeah. Go talk to him for a second. I swing wide. Yep. How you doing, sir? Excuse me. You hear me? How you doing, bud? Sheriff's office. Howdy. See you uh, running around up here making sure you're doing all right. Not being chased by a snake or anything. <laughs> no, no snakes around these parts. Just, oh, they're uh, out here. You got to be careful. Haven't seen any yet. That's good. So how you doing today? Yeah, pretty good, Mister. You need to probably think about taking a bath there. <laughs> I'm back from a long trip, so waiting on the bath to get warm. Yep. So how you doing today, bud? Ain't yeah, too bad. I'm just checking out all the names here. Oh, okay. Some clues, you know, you know. It's clues. The world out there, you know, clues. What kind of clues, if you may? I ask. Oh well, yeah, I mean, I, I don't know. It's there's a lot of secrets out here, you know. Oh. Uh -huh. Secret recipes and things you don't know. You know, been looking looking for cave paintings. You know, anything that'll give me a clue or breadcrumb leading to something else. Oh, okay. Well, a treasure hunter. Well, adventure. You know, I'm not really after the money there, so you know. Find something long lost and forgotten, huh? Yep. One All of these right. graves over here only is like that. Each one of these is like a baby. Yeah. It's like three years. It happened. Damn shame. Yep. Well, I'll let you get back after it. If you need anything, the sheriff's office is right down the road here. Yep, no problem. Just, you know, I'll be here digging tonight, so, you know. Oh, you can't dig in, you, you can't dig in the graveyard, sir. <laughs> You can't go. Okay. Nah, okay. 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 Growing some of that swamp herb, you know, minding my own business. Shame you ain't digging. I just got these shiny new pair of bracelets, and I was hoping to put them on someone today. Hey, there you go. Don't mind me. I can't afford any rent here in the property. Okay. I'll honor you, cuss. He's on the. Yeah, he did. Good for him. He's a particular feller. Indeed. I just saw him hopping all around up there. I was just wanting to check on him. Probably did it just so he could talk to somebody. I believe it. Oh, goodness gracious. These folks is always acting so busy around here. <laughs> yeah. Well, being a higher up, you get a lot more paperwork, that's for sure. Came for the badge. How we doing, Doc? Doing all right. How you doing, Luca? Doing okay. Did you get a nap in yet? I don't need to know, brother. Mm, okay. No, see, this is the mindset we're trying to avoid to get you to feel better. Push, Jack. 
he said he'd be back in a minute. Not sure. I don't know, let's go on a walk. Let's go on a walk. Like it's a slow healing process though. <laughs> Not too sure, I thought he ran down to the saloon, but I didn't see him there. His horse still here. Your horse is invisible. Hey, your horse or somebody else's? Which one? This. Oh, this one. Is mine. God damn it! Yeah, he's running off. <laughs> oh, ain't my horse anymore. Oh, might want to dismiss him. Oh, oh, jeez. There he goes. Lord. And go re grab your horse then? No, I don't think I'll need one at the moment. No, oh, okay. Yeah, they don't like that doctor's post. Very long, it seems. Speaking of horses, it looks like his is invisible. Your horse is invisible. I'll go fix it. Alrighty. Horses are having a hell of a time since the storm tonight. Mm -hmm. That they are. I did take a nap twice before mine showed up. <laughs> Clean myself up here. Yeah, some higher-ups are particular about your uniform being dirty. Yeah. I'll get to that. Matter of fact, I'll go get to that now, so I'll be back here in a few minutes. Hopefully Jack's back. If not, I'll just resort to Monroe and call it a night here. Already? I see it, but now you're hopping next to it. Oh my God, it's Adelaide food. Hello. You hear me, sir? Oh, Adi, you broke. Yeah, I'm just gonna fuck it off. Oh, Adi, you broke a bit of time. You have. Oh gosh, what's going on? So Luca has completely lost all of his memory, and uh... we're now debating whether to put him in a fucking asylum, Sissica, or take him to Ali's house for a few days and lock the fucking door. Oh, jeez. We just had to have a mini meeting, me, <laughs> me, Jack, Talon, Riley, just to kind of figure out. He's there, look, walking with uh, Ali. Uh... He, he, he doesn't. He doesn't know what's going on yet. Why? Uh, he got shot or something, and 
sorted. Uh, it's, it's long and complicated. And uh, Well, I guess I'm in luck because I'm not clocking in. <laughs> <laughs> Jack's around somewhere. I think yeah. he's on a roof. I am sicker than a dog once again. But really? I was just seeing. Yeah, there's something up. I got some blood work done the other day, so hopefully we will find out by Monday. Hopefully it's all good. Yeah, it's like the fucking fifth or sixth time, not even within a month yet, that I've been fucking sick as hell. That's no good. I've doctors like eight times already. Yeah, I want to go change out of this. Okay. Like the first time you met the captain? Well, the no. Captain. Yeah, no. Remember. Okay, good. I ran into her a few times. Good, good, good. Oh, you're all spiffy. Oh, yeah, man. Got her in her $2. I don't know what they're going to do with him. Where the hell Jack ran off to? Hmm. Right, where um, they right. Hey, what? Can I have that talk? Pardon? Oh, yeah, yeah. If you're only if you're ready. Yeah, yeah, of course. Give me one second to get a fucking wagon out. Lord. Oh, were you taking him over there? Yep, so get ready for him to run. Okay. Why would he run? He's just because he doesn't want to get... Oh, I don't see a wagon. Uh, How neither do, do I. Fuck. Negative. All I wanted to do was buy a horse today. <laughs> Jeez. That's all I wanted to do. Water like crazy, man. What the fuck? <laughs>
hopefully they're having that heart to heart there. Can I speak to you? How we doing, Apollo? Uh, we're doing good. What about you? You can't complain. A fella in a fancy wagon came by earlier looking to buy something from you. But he said, you know, move on down the road. So I don't know what he was on about. Uh, I was, I was stuck in the steering for like three fucking hours. Yeah. I figured as much, but I figured I'd give you a heads up too. You don't see a fancy wagon very often. So I didn't know if you knew him or not. Yeah, I don't know. Alrighty. A lot of con uh, contacts have been lost because they've been fishy by federal laws, you know what I mean? Hmm. Well, I figured I'd just give you a heads up, though. He was out, yeah, he was out here for a good hour or so, so. Oh, yeah, no, I was in line. Yeah, I I told him as much. So, I <laughs> out of county, woke up, <laughs> and I'm still in line. Oh, good gravy. <laughs> well, it's good to see you about, man. Figured I'd just, that's all I needed. Give you a heads up. Is that Luca? He doesn't look the old guy. Mm -mm. Is he still out of commission? Not sure.
I'd give him space right now, though. Alright, well, where's, uh... There. So what's the plan here? I don't know. I'm trying to figure that out. Oh. I just woke well, up. I think, uh, Jack's up the hill there having to talk with the other assistant. I haven't been doing my job lately. I'm just so bent up from it. I don't blame you there. And the train rides lately has been insane. But let me get after this, bud. You have a good day. You too. Well, that's one way to do it. <laughs> But as soon as they move, won't he just slide off the back? No, no, I mean, you can flex your space muscle and just be on your side. Oh, yeah, yeah. Does that work for you, Luca? Then you want to do it. Oh, oh, oh. How'd you do it? I went in there. Oh, no. Oh, no. Is that Luca? <laughs> Come here, stand, stand right here for me. How you get her out now? Oh, that works. Right. Uh, we're going for a ride, guys. Are we waiting on them or no? Oh, we need to hurry up. I'm asking, I don't know. How are we doing, Chef? We're going for a ride up towards Emerald, taking Luca. M3. Okay. What are you thinking about right now? Who, me? Yeah. A lot of Um, <laughs> we can later, yeah, we can.
In order, you? you know, I'm really sorry, guys. I'll go piss. You probably will. Be a good girl and put the lasso away. There you go, good girl. Oh, I hate you sometimes. No, you don't. I really don't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on. You, I can't believe he's done this. Like, What's I, what I, happened? I always forget your name. It's it's Jake, right? Yes, ma'am. I remembered. Thank you. First person that hasn't called me Jim in a while. <laughs> I told everybody just call me by my last name since we have so many J's here. Names that start with J right, or well, sound I like J. We, I reckon we just, uh, who do we really need? I mean, Riley's here, so it's fine. We can do it with just us lot. I got one of them. Yeah, I mean, you know, it's not like we've been doing this for two, three hours, and he chooses now. Could have done this earlier with him when he asked. When Tal, when Tal told me and I relayed the information over to him, he could have done it then. Well, well. Let's go now. Yeah, let's go. Look, are you ready, mate? I think he's having a shit. More than three shakes, you're playing with it, Luca. More than three shakes, you're playing with it. The longest piss I've ever seen. He in his head? Might be in his head for a second. <sighs> Sleepy James. <laughs> oh. Little deputy. Thank you. I was about to do that. Wow. <laughs> I'm part of my conversations. Are we going or what? I think we are, mate. Yeah, this guy. 
Yeah. Come on, now, mate. Jump in the back. Come on, Luca. In you go. Come on, lad. Come stand right yeah. next to me. Like, there you go. In you go, lad. There you go. Take a step. Take a step in. Why? Never wants to put Luca in. I know. Yeah, but you're submissive. Luca's a bit of a... Fair. It's because I lost my memory, huh? I can't put you in, mate. Hey, Riley. You want to try to put him in? I can't put him in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Riley? Oh, this is the Sheriff. You remember Sheriff Riley? Come here. I'm right here. There we go. Ali, you're here, aren't you? It comforts me, Doctor. Oh, no, right, jump on Riley, let's go. Oh, it's the boys. I needed a, a soft cushion. Ah, fucking guy. Yeah, the guy. Sheriff's the guy. Uh, Sheriff's the guy. Sheriff's the guy. Fucking leave with us. Oh yeah, well, I mean we've been doing this for two years. Well, I don't have a feeling you might be lying about that. How am I as one for adding my mom at the same time? Huh. It keeps saying run. It's like on the lower part of the
better than a fucking dungeon. You have players who can get how do you get up there? Where would you be sleeping, Doctor? Why do you let all her chickens go? Where I'm gonna be spending my next yep. few days. Next few days, hey, mate. And if I want food or. There's something you can eat every day, I guess. Just, uh... What's a fly zone? Hey Doc, you need to get some light in here. Alright. Kinda looks like my head right now. Why is it with this shit? <laughs> you christened in the toilet. What now? I was making sure it's safe, you know? Monroe and O'Reilly. Uh huh. Y'all better catch that motherfucker. We will, mate. In the meantime. Have you got your badge, your cuffs on you? Have they been, have you handed them in? Are they in your locker? Uh, they are in my storage. Okay. You've got a gun on you, haven't you, to protect yourself? Only to protect yourself. Uh, my gun, they, uh, my gun fell down in roads when, uh, they, they were chasing me. Okay. <sighs> Alright, is there anything you need on you right now? Anything food-wise, bandage-wise? Um, some water. Let me give you this bread. Appreciate that. Thank you. That's some peach tea. Appreciate that. And there's a bandage if you fall over. One of the good ones. Thank you so much. When y'all catch that motherfucker, right, baby. I want to put a bullet in his head. Watch him now. <laughs> What we'll do, um, we'll try and figure out a nice little time to meet up. We can come see you every day or every other day, just until you're feeling a little bit better. Uh, we can bring Ali out here to give you a quick once over, see how you're getting on. You know, like cognitive stuff, memory tests. In the meantime, I'm trying to think if there's anything that you can read or anything that you can do to look at. To you said I was a. Uh... Swamp Herp Addict, right? <sighs> it was a joke, mate. He wasn't an addict, no. Well, good thing I don't remember that. <clears throat> yeah. I guess my addiction is gone now, huh? <laughs> I hope so. What a way to lose your addiction. And by forgetting all about it. Alright, Ali, what do you want us to do? Do you want us I'm to sorry like... if I, uh, I'm sorry if I caused problems today in Valentine. Uh, you're right, mate. You haven't caused any issues. The just, LSA you know, guys brought you back. I can't just sit there knowing that someone hurt someone that's really close to me, you know, and I, I'm sitting here, can't do shit. But doctor, uh, promise she will help me. Mm -hmm. What we can do, Luca, we'll have to figure out a time, mate. We'll have to figure out some time we can bring you supplies and bring Ali down to see you. I mean, she knows her anyway, I, so she can keep an I eye can, on you. I was gonna say, I can take care of it. Once again, if I get any reports of reading any nonsense, it won't be for me. And I know you're you know, not riding ahead, but still, you know, you're, you're representing me, so keep it that way. As long as you catch that motherfucker, I will keep myself. Under control. Venison. See? Look, look, dinner's practically fucking there. I will give him actual food. 
I gave you the food. Stay safe, stay safe. I'll be back Valentine later. I'll be safe. Anything, let me know. Have you got a way of getting back? Um, I'll run back. Oh, you want me to wait on you or? Um, no, I'll be okay. Worst case is I can send a telegram from Emerald. Okay. Stay safe. Take it easy. So that's where you stay at, dog? The goat. The goat. Can I see the goat? Half a kitty, Deputy. How did you go, boys? Oh, it's Humble. Oh, good chat. How's he doing? How'd you go? He's, he's jumped off. He's alright. He's um he's up at Ali's ass now, so Did you break him in? Uh Ali didn't want us to break him in. She's gonna keep an eye on him. Ah. Right, she could do that through uh, like a little bringing. gap in the window. Well I th I thought it was gonna look How you doing, man? She might choose to. I'm good, are you? We're good. How are you doing? Break him in. Do you wanna break him in? Oh, there you go. I love peach tea. If you ever need to sell any, I'm in Valentine. Well, I'm in Valentine. I'll, I'll be more than happy to take some from you. I got to catch up with you over here, though. You have a good night, ma'am. Yeah, have a good night. You will go, go, go. Then he just started acting like dogs. <laughs> I thought it was that fucking dogs. <laughs> I don't believe you. Jesus Christ. Hey, hey James. James. Yo. What does nonce mean? A nonce is a pedo. Oh my god. <laughs> I told you. He just Shit. said he's okay. glad that, that Ripley left because he said he's a nonce. And I was like, what, <laughs> and what gives you that indication? He goes, yeah, he's a fucking idiot. I was like, that's not what nonce means. <laughs> oh my god. I can wagon through the mud. I want to see how, how it ends. <laughs> what the fuck? What? Oh, Jesus. Oh, How are we going? Hi, boy. Is that you, Phyllis? Sorry, James. Mate, I didn't realize you were in front of company. Is that you, Phyllis? Yeah, How are you, handsome? Good, good. Sorry, James. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Sorry, I thought you, uh, oh, I thought you were stuck on the ground. You kept, like, hey, flopping all over the place. I was going well. I'm just waiting for my friend Spinny. She was with oh. us, and then she got her hair caught on a tree. 
Oh, yeah. Jesus. Yeah. Got a weave cord or? Mm -hmm. Yeah, she flew off my horse. Is that she, Mr. Gray? That's me. Fucking How are you going? It's Arlo, right? Yeah. How are you, Arlo? I'm doing all right. You guys been behaving? Never. Yeah, Never. Yeah, I read I mean, your arrest course. report, Miss uh, Miss Phyllis. I make a habit to uh, know arrest? who is and isn't in trouble in the county, and you are not on Santa's no, uh, nice list I at the moment. Don't think I was in true rubble. I was burying a cat. My lovely pet, Mittens. Were you in reverse when you were burying the cat? No, there was a misunderstanding. I am not a criminal, Mr. Gray. I'm a lovely woman. That is true. You, you can be two things at once. Oh. And be a lovely woman and a criminal. Right, How's Maya today? Is she a little well? girl. No, she is. <laughs> oh my god. I have not That's seen right. her. You guys can go independent. But Mr. Gray, I promise I'm going to be a good girl for daddy. Okay, well, that's what we like to hear. What about you, Arlo? Are you going to be a good girl for daddy? I'll be a good boy. No, no, that's not what I asked you. Right, why am I, I pants getting tight? <laughs> oh, my dear why God. Are pants getting tight? I think I'm making bread. Uh, uh, I'm going to go away by the wagon. <laughs> She's gonna have a bun in the oven in no time. You want a muffin? <laughs> Your muffin top. Oh. You know nothing about top. Don't work, Phyllis. I thought you left me. No, baby. We, 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 I realized I lost you and I turned my horse around. You know, I've seen this scene before. Wait, who are these folks? A bunch of big who? men around some Who women. are these folks? Yeah. Sonny, how dare you? This is Mr. Oh, Gray. Oh, hi, Mr. Gray, nice Daddy Gray, how's it going? <laughs> I'm doing all right. Mr. Gray, can I borrow eight dollars? Eight dollars? Yes, yes, you can. Thank you. What do you need eight dollars for? Well, I'm currently indebted eight dollars, <laughs> and I left all my money in a white town out. Thank you very. Oh, well, thank can you. Can I Mr. also Gray. borrow something from you? Oh, you can get it from Sunny. I just gave her a bit of money. No, I, I don't think she I wants don't need money. money. Oh, I would like to borrow a little bit of spit. What? A bit of what, sorry? A bit of spit. Sit. Spit. 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 Oh, yeah, Spittle. Wow. Yeah, could yeah, you sure. spit in my mouth? Oh, what the fuck? I like this view. Oh, oh. Oh, you missed it. Land on the floor. One more time. Ah. Uh... Oh, my lord. Thank oh, you. Oh, my god. Yeah. I was Bitch, really that thirsty. Is not a mouth. That is a gullet. <laughs> a gullet. I was really Suck thirsty. Suck that up like a goddamn flathead fish. Wait, does anyone thank have a you. spare bandage by chance? Yeah, uh, no, bad. but I can. Oh, thank you. you can go in Italian, get one. What, what are you guys up to? We were oh, just having a work. strawberry. Oh, okay. Yeah. Phyllis, when it's... are you going to come get your gift from me? Thank you, sir. Well, I'm here. Yeah, well, we've got to make it first. Oh. And no, it it's a not baby? a baby. Relax. I was gonna say. Oh my god! I don't know if I <laughs> want to be carrying no baby. No, I've had enough of that. Um. <laughs> no, I wanna. You said you had a knife, right? Yeah. Yeah. What's your favorite color? That's a good question. What is my favorite color? A pink or something? Yeah. yeah red. Like red, pink. Well, blue, next time you're in town, we'll get. Green. uh yeah, we'll get you down to a blacksmith. Uh, sorry, not a blacksmith, a gunsmith, and we'll get that knife customized. I have to have any tea. gunsmith. They don't tea. like me there. No, yeah. we'll go to another one when you uh, when you guys are free. We'll pop down a rose some or something tea. and get this it uh, customized. It. It's too salty. Well, you know, oh. I think we're quite free right now. What are you, are you guys? Yeah, free? we'll do, uh, pop over to Valentine then, and we'll go. We'll go down to Rhodes. Okay, doke. Do you mind if we just stop in Strawberry first so I can get honey bun? Oh, yeah, I think your horse. All Come right. for a trip down to, uh, okay. to Rose Tower and get, we'll get apples. We go to Strawberry, get her horse, then we come back to Valentine and meet you there. Okay. Sound good? Thank you very much. It's good. You want to okay. go to Rose Tower, we'll get apples. Oh. What? We'll go, we'll take these guys down to Rhodes. I want to give Phyllis, Wait. upgrade her knife. We'll customize a knife and then um, we'll pick apples and we'll come back so we get something out of the trip. I bought like 400 apples for the. <laughs> that are all in the oh, soccer oh, right yeah. Well, then we, we can still go down there. Oh, wow. Well. Yeah, we'll, we'll get peaches instead. I'll Wait, make some peach tea for everyone. I need to get yeah, sugar. Yeah, that. 
Let's do that. Do y'all know if I can make an apple get pie with from? these apples? You get well, peaches, you come, you come down with us and we'll show you. Yeah. Okay, but well, we Wait, gotta go to strawberry first. Wait, can you teach me how first. to make tea? Because I've been trying to learn and it's kind of complicated. Um, that would be That's an expensive to thing. Yeah, so the recipes are really expensive because it's, you know, information. Um, and they change if enough people know them. Oh, yeah. Because yeah. right. so, I'm trying to too. open up an orchard, but I'm trying to learn how to make different things people might want. Yeah, well, if you hang around Valentine a little bit more, um, maybe blew up Tal a little bit. And see All if right. you, uh, you can get him to maybe, maybe you guys could give the... Oh, you get you one, we get you fucking growing sugar cane, actually, and then we can get the sugar and the oh, tea, and then. That. Oh, well, there you go. Yeah. Well, maybe we can. Oh, maybe we can I something else. Talk with Tao because he's. Apples. Oh my god! I need a lot of sugar. Yeah, he's got the recipe, so maybe we can go to strawberry and then come back and we'll talk about it. Because okay. I, mean, I want to buy Thirty minutes. Right. Right. Thank you. Mwah. Might have just got ourselves some sugar farmers. Good, because I need the sugar. It's the only thing I need. I can get the peaches You're myself. You're by the way. Oh. Because I got off to spit in Phyllis's mouth. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? Ugh. That lady down that was farming down there was farming sugar cane as well. I need sugar cane. I mean, like, sugar is a little annoying because right now you get a stack of 64, but can only process 50 at a time. Um, yeah, if they can get, like, a few hundred sugar or something, I'll pay them for it. Like, processed and stuff, and then I can turn it into tea. I just need peaches, and that's basically it. Peaches are very easy for me to get, though. Wouldn't take too long, I just kind of idle for a bit. The same way you get apples. Yeah, actually, if a few of us do that, it'll be so easy to just get, like, a hundred peaches or something. That makes two hundred tea. Well, if we bring them all down there, we'll just say we'll give them like 20 cents a peach or some shit. And then we'll just pick peaches for free and you just give us peach tea or whatever the fuck. Yeah, I'll just give you tea. We, just, they, we need like sugar though. Yeah. We need to pay them something, something half decent for the sugar. I mean, the sugar would be pretty easy for them. It's 14 a plant. It's a few cents. You know, we pay them like 25. We have to teach them out. Like... So they're new, so that's why I kind of... I like Phyllis. Phyllis is... Just, we flow with each other just for fun. I like Missy, but... um. She, uh, they're new. Them and their whole group is new, so, and they've been hanging out with people who are kind of drawn to them because they, uh, have a bit of a... But they're not actually, no one's actually teaching them how to do shit, you know what I mean? Oh, okay, interesting. Wait, where did they go then? Oh, uh, they went to Strawberry to go get a, um, what, get their horse out of the stable, and then they said they'll We'll go down to Rhodes with them, but we'll have to do it kind of off-duty. Yeah, that's fine. Well, just let me know. Who was on the route? Huh? It's in the roof. Which have just fallen. They have just fallen. Good. Are you okay? What are you fine on the roof for? Uh, it has a certain charm to it. Well, if you like, you like smelling like horse shit and mud all the time, I guess. <sighs> Run and get some water right it's quick. Shit hole. That's okay. Fuck, like, I'm, it's I'm, our shit hole, you know? I'm not like, you know, it's no offense to you. Yeah, a bunch of water, a bunch of bread. Excuse me. Notify 
technically would have lost. Requesting any about because oh, we're closest. We oh shit! Okay. Can we get it? Alright, man up boys, I'm gonna leave a quick note for Phyllis, cause I don't know how long we'll be gone for. Who fucks Phyllis? A feller. I mean, two of us can go, or all four can go, or three. Cause I'm gonna we'll send a full posse, cause we don't wanna get fucked, I don't want us guys to die. Why is that feller on the roof? Alright, tell him to make sure you have your guns, herbal bandages. I don't have any, somebody got some. I don't have any fucking herbal bandages. Do you have any? What do they got going on? Gunfight, blue water. Mm hmm. Damn it, I thought I had spares in here. I have a bandage. Do I need to go buy some more? Um, yeah, maybe just get like two. Jake, do you have a talent? Ah! Say that again. Go get those bandages right quick. Fast, please. Oh, don't Let's worry. Go. By the time we arrive, it'll be well and over. Gun battles do not last this long. By the time they sent the telegram, that's probably fucking bodies carried right. down somewhere else. Already ten minutes, basically. Yeah. Well, I find something. Either we find them dead, or we either find the four of them really finished. Is that a thoroughbred? Yes, sir. Appreciate it. I just gotta get the timing of giving him an apple while we're sprinting down. Yeah, it's a fully chained door. Oh, yeah. Fully trained. He's getting up there in age, though. I'm gonna have to get a fresh one here soon.
Och bilen kan vi läsa. What, uh, where is everyone? There's only me here. What's your name? Brandon Moreno. Ah, uh, yes, Moreno. We yeah, chatted Moreno. before. Yeah. How are you doing, sir? How are you doing? I'm doing good. Uh, listen, we had reports of a large shootout occurring here recently. Um, no, what I recall of, I've just I've been here for about... Well, for oh, about do you think they mean the ranch, or do you think they mean the mosque Yeah, itself? but the mosque. Saddle up in the wrong place. Oh fuck, they're talking about uh, Okay, oh, they're talking the about the grow spot. spot. Yeah, yeah they're talking about the grow spot. Stay safe, stay safe. So it's a big drug bust. Hey, okay. we, we want to take this slow then. Slow up. They'll gun in. I mean, they got shotguns, okay? I've got a bolt action. Same. Keeping my distance to a safe, moderate, medium. Yep. Makes sense. How close or far? Close or far? Far, far. Uh, where I'm pointing, where I'm pointing. They're all out there somewhere. Alright, I'm gonna go kill them. I'll be back. Hey, we got a huge supply of sugar just south of us. We got deputies. What the fuck is this? Want us to start trying to move? Make right sure here, right here. Two, two people, two people. I've tagged them a bunch of times. Get the numbers of the downed ones. Okay. They keep disappearing. Up against the <laughs> Come on, then peek me again, you fuck. Put your hands up, last chance. Still one more, still one more around here somewhere, still one more. How do I look around? Yep. Yeah. Right. So. Do a bandage check, your fourth fucking Yes, up. stand by, hang on. Fucking down bullshit. Right here. White shirts and shit. I'm gonna start shooting. Wait, watch left, 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 left. That's bullshit. I'm stuck, stuck. Oh, that's why. There we go.
Ah, uh, yeah, I do. Where are you? <laughs> you. Sheriff's right. office, call out. Ray. Did you get advantage? Down, Lawman. I think. Yep, right here. Should I put you on the road, mate, so they can <laughs> see you a bit easier? No worries. Caught me in the crossfire. Jack, Jack, Fuck. Jack. Yeah, mate. I found some of the seeds and two guns back here. Uh, there's, they've got, there's one down. Do you know where he went? Oh, you found him. Nice, nice. Alright, do you want to pick him up, man? Alright, Jack, I'm going for the criminal. He goes this way. Sorry, what? I'm going for the criminal over here. Alright. So the girls are over there somewhere. I don't know where your name is, but... Alright, alright. Coming, I'm coming. Alright, good shit. I'll cover you. Appreciate it. Pick him up. Uh, I'm still moving in the trees to the south and west. Alright, well, I picked up the one that I shot down. Same, I got one of mine. The last shot. Yep, this is a deputy. Yeah, deputy's on one side, suspect's on the other. Hmm. Deputy here. Okay. Oh, you're dropping all them here. Where do you want the suspects? The suspects over this side, deputies over that side. All right, got it. Hmm. Shit, man. Okay. Where's there's a horse? Anyone have a horse, sir? Uh, my oh, horse is long gone. Probably up yeah. somewhere, I think. Cow. Oh, fuck. Sir Graham, telling medical, we have medical and telling other law where we are. One, two. Holy shit. Oh my fuck. Talk about anarchy. <laughs> if you can get your girls here, just to move the bodies. Me and Jack are gonna go make sure Holy it's clear. Holy fuck! <laughs> Alrighty. Yeah, let's go, Jack. <laughs> right. Jack, I, I can't. I we had a Where's... witness come to Annisburg, tell us a shootout broke up here, and we came down, and this is what we found. Yeah, good thing I'm here now. I'm <laughs> gonna do some killing. I'll be right. Yeah, all right. Where's Henrietta? Uh, shit. You stay here. Uh, watch out the bodies. Right. What the fuck was he doing? He was still hogtied. Annabelle, did you? Oh lord. Annabelle, you're gonna be all right. Just. Keep breathing. Keep breathing. Keep breathing. None of you are dying. <laughs> These fucking bones are cracking me up. Oh my fucking god, I think someone's dead. <laughs> wow. If that's real, that's gonna suck. I might even cry. Shit. Shit. There you is. Who do we have? 
Plenty. Hell. Oh hey, my everyone. goodness. What did two two? Oh fuck! I guess the two two five guy just decided to vanish. <laughs>